Anyone have any racy comments? As soon as we start the stream, I'm just gonna be like. That that was the start of the that was the start of the the, the stream. Anybody else have any racist comments left? <laughs> <laughs> Can you link me your stream? For some reason, my my Facebookness. I'll link it. And I'm gonna yeah, link to 20. the um. Yeah, my computer saved that web. It's on roll twenty. Thank you. No problem. Uh, I'm glad the stream started off with that. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be a good night, guys. It's gonna be a good I game. I want to accept our overlords. Thank you, Jojo. Oh yeah, so I updated my spell list since I got new spells. So Laura, you think it's gonna be a good night? I think it's gonna be a bad one. I just missed my mouth while trying to drink from a water bottle. Oh, it's great for us. Yeah. Oh shit. And then Nanashi dies. Oh my god! If anyone dies, because his owner wants him to die. No, I'm jinxing myself. Why? Because why his you owner being... wants him to die. Tell me why you want Nanashi to die. I know you've been getting a lot more erratic with him and putting him in bad scenarios to try to like off him or have him have penalties. What's with that? I don't know. I just find it less interesting to play him now because it's been months. Hmm. I see. But it's one of those I don't want him to like. I don't want him to be killed by my uh by my role play. I just want him to die by happenings. So, so only like so only the dice gods can predict the death of Nanashi. So <laughs> how about I just make him die in the most unsatisfactory way? Cause that wouldn't please the streamers at all. You have died of dysentery. <laughs> <laughs> right. Jordan make a new character. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, do you wanna go with Solid Snake or do you wanna go with Neither. another sort of thing? <laughs> no. Because I was messing around no. earlier, and I'm like, oh, I wonder what it would be like if I made Solid Snake inside of this thing. Nope. Pull up your character uh, sheet. Roll some D D6s. Zaxter. Zaxter! No items. <laughs> Box right, only. Guys, Final destination. <laughs> okay, cool. So this means I win naturally. <laughs> as long as there's no Bowser, I'm fine. Zaxter, what's up? Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and post on the Twitter. See, even Zax is like, don't kill Nanashi. But, but. We can't kill no, Nagasaki, that's... the child killer. He has to be yeah. slayed by a proper child. <laughs> by a proper child? <laughs> yeah, no, like a five year old needs to, like, come up and just stab him in the heart. So they grow when he's asleep? <sighs> and then just, like, hundreds of children stab him, and then it's like the death of Julius Caesar. What if he died by blood loss from thousands, millions of mosquitoes? How would you, how would you feel about that? Because hey, reasons. That's stupid. <laughs> exactly. Twat. Oh, right, Twitter. Should. Thanks for reminding me. You should not try to kill Nanashi. Yeah. I'm, not tr I'm not trying to kill him. It's one of those, I want him to die, but the likelihood of him dying at this point in time is really low. It's okay, we'll see what happens tonight. All right, everyone ready? Uh, I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Oh, thank you, thank, thank you for stealing my thunder there, Jojo, but I agree. <laughs> well, I, Where we last left our oh. heroes, they all just arrived in Emeraldia. Um, Ducky, where did you set them down from the windwalk? Out, like, at the out, right outside of town, like, by oh, the gates? Oh, so right outside city gates, got okay, it. Yeah. So Nanashi is gonna, like, move off, and then he's gonna put on that, uh, cloak that he has, the cloak of Elvenkind. <laughs> oh! Yeah. He's, well, so he really. doesn't know what, he doesn't know what it is, he just knows what he has it for, and he can, like, conceal his identity and just kind of trail the border of the town. Indeed. How close does Ducky get to the town before Nanashi does. I want to know, like, the, like, is it, like, right at the front gate, or is it, like, 50 feet out? I would, give me a... Oh, fucking shit! Um, I guess... Let me flip a coin. Because <laughs> it depends. If Ducky lends you right in front of the Jesus, guards, yes. then... Fuck. 50 feet away, I suppose? I'm gonna... I'm going to break everything in my room trying to find something now. A lizard? Because <laughs> I... No, I look... No, not a lizard this time. I look down at Ducky my lizard. track pad and a fucking big ass spider was just right next to my thumb. He wants to play. <laughs> no, he needs to die. He got in my fucking space. Oh, that shit. and I've been that and I've had a shit ton of spider fights recently, so you, no survivors. You should feed the spider and turn it into spider bro. No! Spider they all bro. have to die. Spider bro is nicest though. 
I don't know where it went though, so I'm fucking terrified now. Because it wasn't Spider Bro. If it was Spider Bro, you could fucking leave it and it'd be fine. Spider Bro. Spider Bro. Spider Bro is best, bro. So much, bro. We Spider Bro. Nice. I don't know where it is. It needs to die. Keep an active lookout for it while we play. Alright. All you, all you hear is like Nanashi running around screaming, FUCKING SPIDERS! Alright. So you're 50 feet out. I had to make some guards roll spot checks. Well, and Nanashi disappears into the woodworks. Yeah, wait. The woodworks. We all make spot checks? Alright. No, the guards do. Oh. Okay. Die! What is the party? Die! Do? Die! Once they arrive. <laughs> Tell me what the party is once they arrive. Um, I'm gonna address the elephant in the room, and um... What are we gonna do about Nanashi? And then all of a sudden Nanashi's gone. <laughs> yeah, oh, Nanashi gonna... walked into the woods. As soon as I they went. Nanashi's leaving? Nanashi pulled on a cloak and like... Like put it over his head and then... Just kind of walked off into the woods. Did he tell them he was doing this? No. Okay, that solved uh, that problem. He, he kind of didn't have, like, time to do so. No meta. Just, that's roleplay. Um, he just walked off, guys. Lohengrin chimes in. So is anyone going to tell me what happened with that, by the way? He done you. Should, should, we, uh, on? should we just give him okay. the spiel? Let's, let's catch him let's up. Let's give him the spiel. Oof. I forgot Lohengrin's there. The spiel! Alright, so you tell him what's up. Spiel, 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 spiel. Spiel right. with a side of spiel. For viewers who don't know, Nanashi fucked up a town. He was the, and he was given the option. Uh, he also saved the t part of the town, so they gave him the option to never return, or if he does return, to be imprisoned. So, it'd be worse. He could have killed the captain of the guard's wife. Yeah, fucking August. <laughs> anyway, um. <laughs> <laughs> not like there's like another one of her lying around. There's not another one of those Marys. There's tons of Marys, but not the one that's that I captain loves. Oh, she was that's one like, of the kind. That's like being married to a twin, killing her and being like, at least there's another one. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> this is wow, fucking the one. Dexter, we're using Skype, but we really should use Teamspeak. Damn, they don't have we like Skypes. Skippy. All right. Um. So yeah, give me what's going on with you guys. How no, doing it up. How you guys <laughs> present yourself in this town cuz you just arrived, you have a mission. You have limited money. I Ducky's go over to the one of the guards. Ducky waves at them. Uh, you them. notice as you walk up one of the guards near the gate has left his post and there's only one guard standing there. Oh god. Do uh does Ducky well, recognize one of them's this? not coming back? <laughs> <laughs> Does Dick recognize one of the guard who remains? No, it's a big city. Never mind then. Yeah. Hello there, good sir. We have come <laughs> to pay it tribute is. to the wedding that is about to occur. Oh my god. Ah. What? Oh. Wait, wait. What? Man, oh, he, he walked away from you guys. Palm. You walked what? up to the guard. You guys are still like 50 feet away. Okay, well then. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, okay, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where are we? <laughs> if you guys are, you if guys you are 50 feet Skype. away, you okay. were explaining things to Lohengrin. Okay. Sir Marcus walked off, went to the guard, and said this. Okay. Now she's gone. It's I thought Ducky. we all went with him. When I say give you me your actions, you have to give me your actions. I was Nashi. drinking a Mountain Dew. It's important here. <laughs> Nanashi climbed a tree. <laughs> And scrapes his knee. His dress has got a tear. What's going on? <laughs> okay, uh, no, you're no, no, with Sir Marcus when he says this. <laughs> Jordan, you then now she falls and hits his head on the rock. Oh. <laughs> make a new character. Give <laughs> yeah, make a new Stop fucking around and again. Oh my god. Give me uh fortitude to not pass out. Oh great. <laughs> Cool, this means that I could just automate. This is gonna be like that oh bar God. thing that you pulled on me before with that bullshit. <laughs> yeah, it could be you slipping, tripping on a, on a wagon. You spot check to notice him plummet from a tree? Too far away. Wow. <laughs> no, no, you're on the ground unconscious. 
You're oh, not near the road, though. I mean, you walked into the woods. You're just on campus next to I know, but this to means that if he goes out of his way to look, that I'm immediately going to prison. Again. <laughs> Alright, so he's passed out. Don't so right? you, All I can say as a player is, so far, so good. Alright, alright, hold, 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 hold the phone. Where are we? <laughs> I will say gates. everyone is at the gates with Sir Marcus. Thank Sir Marcus you. Has I would just like that. to be at the gates with Sir Marcus. Yes. All right, moving forward. So it's Thank just is a rough start. <laughs> Sir Marcus, you say this. Ah, are you of noble of nobility or part of the wedding party? Uh, I am a, from the, the noble house of Greystone. May I see your signet ring? Oh, fist pump up in the air with the signet ring. <laughs> fist pump. Yeah, well, he's up in the air, right? He's like um, at the, t at no, the tower. No, landed. Oh, he's, no, no, the guards at down at your feet. Oh, is that? Oh, is that? He's at he's the same at the level gate. as me. Yeah, yeah. You okay. need a map. Sorry, I thought I was. I'm imagining like you know, mighty python, and there's like go away, or Sean, so I'll do further type of no, distance. No, no, it's just it's just typical city gate guards just sitting at the gate. All right, I will present him my ring. Hmm. Nice ring there. This but is the ring of the Greystone household. Is are these friends part of your party? Uh, yes, they are my company. We have signet rings too. You may enter. Go on cool. in. Have a good time. Enjoy the wedding. Tell me oh. how it is. We will. All right. And you are let in. Wait, why did you say that? We're not here for a party. Well, technically, we are uh, here for the party. We're here to sabotage the party, but that's not the point. No. You might not want to say sabotage the party so close to the guards. I mean, sorry, sorry, I, I was. Uh, that's what Longer says, brother. Yeah. Okay. Good point. I will keep that on the down low. Onward. Is Sir, when did Sir Marcus get so chipper? Oh, uh, Laurel. Actually, oh. let me go ahead and open up my document. I have. I it. have no idea, but give me a he, second. I just th forgot. This isn't how I wanted it to go, and it's her. Not too late now. Player progress. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, so I don't know where the, the Lord's house is. How are we gonna approach this? Are you guys gonna just go straight up and say no, or yes? How I, else are we gonna do it? I'm gonna leave this up to Matthew since this, this is, is his quest. Exactly. This is his thing. I mean. Yes, I just came here just to help and give my support and however he needs it. But I'm not gonna do anything further. It is the 25th day of autumn. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you. Still got a long way for my birthday. It's Should actually not that far away from uh, um, oh, Elise's gosh. and Lohengrin's birthdays, actually. So what's the plan, Matthew? Well, are we storming in there, getting your woman back? Are we going in for a cordial meeting? Well, I mean, these are before your folks. we before we left. Ducky wanted to find out how much the dowry actually was, so I guess that's what we're supposed to do first. Well, what's the most romantic option? <laughs> uh, to have gone to Stephanie, sold some things, came back with the money, and just paid it off. That's what I was thinking. Well, we should find out how much the money is, right? I think we should get the amount first. Right? Yeah. Right, let's go find her parents. Maybe they'll know. Yeah. Do you guys know where she lives? Yeah, yes. we know where she lives. We left. We slept there. All right. Sounds good. Onward. Lead the way, guys. Onward. You lead the way, and you get to the house. <clears throat> um. Is it nighttime yeah. or is it afternoonish? Uh, let's see. You left in the morning. It would be afternoon. It'd be afternoon. Yeah, given how many how much time it is. About like three ish. Uh, well. Uh, uh, like that. Let's see, one, two, three. It's like about five hours. For like for a little between four and five hours, and you so left in the morning, three. so it's probably around yeah, early afternoon. Yeah. Okay. Two. Oh. I'm going to knock on the door. Um, no one answers. You look around and you kind of inspect the windows. It looks empty. Do you think they went to the Lord's house? Probably. Matthew's just gonna just heavily sign. Like, I'm guessing Matthew? that's the second place. Do you need a hug? A little bit. She hugs. Oh. Okay. Well, 
Are you ready? I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Okay. Right. And you go to the Lord's house. You get there, and uh, a guard stops you at the front gate. Matthew, you returned. <gasps> You're not going to cause any trouble, are you? No. And um, and what of your friend? We've heard word that he's in the area. Downtown. I have no idea where he is. Last time we checked, he split up from us. Hopefully he doesn't cause any issues. Me too. Hopefully. Me too. Alright. Um, and who is this one? And he looks at Lohengrin. Oh, she's with me! Oh, if he's with you, then... Yeah! He's her plus one. Uh -huh. Is this that boyfriend I heard about? Oh! Yeah, that's him. This is him. He's he's here. Here, here. Right uh, here. I don't need my own dick or, uh, oh, introduction, Ducky. I'm just... Yeah, I'm just here. Oh. Hello, and he waits. Ooh. Yeah, guard responds. Well, you can come on in. Just, uh... Just wait in the entrance hall, like always. We'll have a, a servant come out to you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. You're led into the house, and uh, a servant sees you and says, "The the uh, the Lord will be right with you." Andrew Lincoln says, "The Walking Dead." Yeah. Um, and instead of the Lord, it is uh, John. John's the one, right? I keep forgetting. Is it John or Daniel? It's John. It's John. Yeah. Daniel's the evil one. You mean Daniel's the one's on drugs? He on was drugs. on drugs. He was on drugs. Yeah. Now you actually get to see him off drugs. Oh. Hmm. Sobriety. Anyway. <laughs> Wait, Daniel? To at least he's actually a pretty leveled off guy. I'm like Aaron Paul. <laughs> so yeah. who who came to greet us? John. John. The your brother, the one who's married yeah. at least. <gasps> like it's like Matthew, welcome back, bitch. <laughs> oh hey Matthew. I had a feeling you'd be coming back. Well, uh, oh. Oh. How have you been? How's your travels? Uh, progress. Progressing. Yeah. So I take it you heard? Yeah, that's why I'm here. Yeah, yeah I knew about the letter. Must have been a long trip. Quite. Yeah. I suppose we should talk. Yeah, that sounds fair. Um, I mean, you're welcome to stay for dinner. At least her family are here. Um, want to do private talk, Matthew, or how do you want to do that? I guess we can talk in private if you... Yeah, just come into the study, and he shows you down the hall. Mm. He kind of pulls up a couple chairs, makes it all nice for you, and says, oh, please sit, sit. Laura has a question. Uh, no, he just knows there's a letter. Okay. He had a, but, I mean, any, you probably could guess. The idea of what's there. Intelligent check. Yeah. yeah, I got what it is. <laughs> yeah. So, did you come here to stop the wedding, Matthew? I'm here to solve some things. Alright. Well, ultimately, that's not up to us. It's up to Elise. I understand that. Oh, shit. <laughs> so, I mean,. Do you have any other things to say about that? Because, uh... Well, I'm just hoping to get a word with her. If... And you have no words me. for me? No, yeah, you can get a word well, with her. I could... I'm I can just, fetch for her if you'd like. It's, I'm just wondering... Of all the females in this town, why did it have to be her? Her? Come on, you know. Well... Absolutely yeah. most stunningly beautiful elf. I have ever laid my eyes on. And she's a great conversationalist. She has great stories about the world she's traveled to. And it's she's an absolute joy to be around. Um, you uh, you kind of introduced me to her. I I'm sorry, but I, I completely fell in love with her. And you were off traveling all the time, and I've heard the stories of what happened at the Scar, and that you were in danger a lot and figured that's no place for a woman and I figured I'd see if Elise was interested and her family was in some debts so my dad arranged a dowry and that fucking dick that's where we are I don't necessarily agree with my dad's dowry but I mean it's saving her family so far the time she's been here has been pleasant 
and happy, so... What a fucking dick! <laughs> Just say <it>. Oh, I said Jordan. Jesus! So, uh, <laughs> she seems to enjoy the company here, so... Um, that's how it happened. I mean, yeah. Thanks for keeping me uh, updated. Do you mind if I speak with her? Of course, I'll get her for you. And then he's just wait right here, and he leaves the room, and he goes and finds Elise. Yep. And so they did. Oh, okay. Yeah, Elise. Uh, John, meet you. Hey, uh, hey, honey. Matthew is waiting for you in my study. If you want to go meet him, he's seemed know. he seemed to travel all the way down here for it. Oh, he's first. Just gives him his big, wide-eyed, blank stare. She nods. Okay, one second. Yeah. I'll be there in a minute. Yeah. Thank you. And, uh, by the way, if it's okay with you, I invited them all to dinner, so it would be nice to have us all sit down. All? And as a family. He seemed to have brought everyone, even a uh, some sort of ranger-looking guy. I've never met him before. She smiles. And it goes away quickly, but she says, yes, um, but that's wonderful. Um, yeah, like I said, I'll be out in a second. If you could give me a minute. Yeah, he, no, it's always right here by the door. Okay, thank you. And she'll take a minute to catch her breath, set her stuff down, and she'll slowly walk over to his study. Okay. Well, when you leave the room and you're like walking away, um, John's like, hey, Elise, I have a question real quick. I have an answer. Cool. You're happy here, right? She By the way, side note, it's been pretty charming here the entire time you've been here. Okay. It may not be Matthew you're with, but he seems like a good enough guy. Okay. Okay. Yeah. She she kind of looks at him confused because she really wasn't expecting that kind of response. She'll say that. Oh. Um. Well, yes, it has. I. It's been or your question was are you happy or oh, I am. Uh, yeah. That's, that's good. He smiles. Okay, I'm I'm really glad. I just want to make you happy. And he shoots you kind of like the the dual point finger. Yes. Make you happy. Anyway, uh, don't forget dinner. It's casual, so don't worry. Okay. Thank you. Wear your jeans. Okay, and <laughs> you go to his study and find Matthew sitting there. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's. Elise is ready to break down. She look. I'm just gonna. I know. Normally, DM would say this, but Elise looks like she hasn't slept. She's happy, but she's still unhappy at the same time. Okay. So she hasn't really slept. <laughs> but anyway, uh, can I make a spot check to see if anyone else is like? If she knows for sure that they are alone in the room. Yeah, go for it. Because Ducky is totally at the door, check. like or search check. Yep. What is rolling, this? listen. Can I roll? Do listen? I have to do anything? Right? No, you guys are in a different room, Ducky. So yeah, yeah, yeah just roll your search. I... Okay, so plus two. Guys, can I take a? Oh my god, guys! Thirty seconds. I gotta wake up my mom. Okay. I think. I'm gonna mess this up. Do, 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 do. How do I do this again? <laughs> uh, forward slash R space. Uh, one D, whatever. Yes. Do I find anything? Nope. There's no one's there. So just a room. Is John in there okay. too? Okay. Just making sure. No, yeah, it's just Matthew awesome. and Elise. Just Matthew, and Elise. Matthew will stand up and uh, smile and say, "It's been a while." She'll look at the ground, and she'll look back up at him, and she'll... Yeah, it has. And she's not... She, you know what? She just doesn't freaking care. She's gonna run over and tag along him. Right. Now kiss. <laughs> <laughs> go on. Finally she'll... Yeah, sorry. Finally she'll let go of him and take a small step back. How have you been? How how are things? Um, things they're well. Hmm. Where do I begin? <laughs> it's totally First, it was awful, but then it was kind of nice. But 
Oh my goodness, you don't even know. <laughs> you it's don't okay. even know. <laughs> it's okay, you don't have to tell me now. You can tell me later. Hopefully we'll have another opportunity to. I just hope I can solve this whole dowry problem. Oh, gosh. Um, You wouldn't happen to have 3,000 gold in your pocket, would you? Sarcastic. <laughs> Would you believe me if I said I had half of that? Well, I would. You know. Like, when is the deadline? You know, that is a good question. I assume any time before the wedding. I. I've talked. She'll put her hand over her face, and then she'll bring it down. I've talked to them about this. I don't. It, John really does love me, and he's not. He's gonna. He's not gonna take too kindly to this. So he's not just not gonna automatically. Like I don't know if he's just gonna be like, okay, here's the diary. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Well, here's to hoping that my father is a uh, more understanding of a man. I don't know about that. You know I don't how know he about was. That either. Yeah. I heard what happened with Nanashi. I don't know about that. <laughs> well, at least you would know that John's pretty accepting of your choices. Okay, cool. And the father is the one that's been pretty adamant about the marriage. Okay. Okay. Is it her father or uh, John's father? John's, John's father. father. Matthew's John. father. Uh, technically. Or Keith. Mm hmm. Okay, so then backtrack. Thank you. So. Just to recap, she'll say that like she's she's not really sure about John, but she thinks that he would be understanding because he told me mm -hmm. know that. And then uh, and then she'll say like, and I heard about the Nashi, and you know what your father is like. Well, let's hope Nanashi knows what not to do because we got here and he just kind of went on his own way. I don't know where he is, so I'm crossing my fingers that he doesn't do anything drastic. <laughs> She'll laugh. And plus, I promised myself I wouldn't cause as much trouble as we did back when we first came here. Well, you didn't do anything. And I know that you're going to do the right thing, whatever that ends up being. <laughs> um, then, yeah, something tells me that she's just going to stay away. Let's hope. He's so stupid. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now, he he can be. Uh, and now <laughs> he kills everybody. In the <laughs> can we roll to see if a bird shits on his face while he's passed out? <laughs> no. Yeah, give me a D100 <laughs> on a nine on a on a 95 <laughs> and above. It was, it was a joke. If someone yeah. rolls a D100 no. on a 95 and above, bird shits on him. Let's see who loves you, Jordan. Damn. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like JoJo wants Jordan to get shit on. <laughs> But he didn't. He didn't, but you wanted it. Because you rolled. Because no one else would do it. I took the initiative. Okay, I see. <laughs> I, I was low. Uh... See what you did there. Nope. Elise. Can I do one? It's so low. Nanashi takes a shit on a bird. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Wash that car real good. <laughs> yeah, get it nice and clean. <laughs> Get in there nice and deep, like. Oh my god. And no one see dodgeball. Are you fucking kidding me? I see dodgeball, I just didn't hear you. What? What? Alright, guys, let's continue. Okay. I gotta roll the plank. Are you happy here? Damn. I am. I, I am. But. This. Like, it's a nice life. It, or, it would be a nice life to have. But it's not the life I want right now. I mean, <laughs> consider my age. I have time. <laughs> and you're here right now, and this is... You're really all I want right now. Aww. <laughs> oh, my shipper heart. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think your parents will accept my help? I know they will. They didn't want to do this. God, my parents. They... <sighs> They didn't talk to me. They they couldn't figure things out with me. They did this without talking to me, and they didn't want to. I don't understand. 
But yes, it's a long story short. <laughs> I'm afraid. I'm afraid. Okay, I, I'll be right back. I can't right now. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Jordan, what the fuck was that? Japan? <laughs> I have no idea what this one person said. <laughs> uh, oh wait, translate. Come on. Pull through to me. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> a blessing for the living, a bouquet of flowers for the dead, with a sword of justice and a punishment of death for the wicked, so get the altar of saints in the name of the. Uh, it, it, was, it was like a scripture? It's a scripture? <laughs> yeah. It's, what? Like Post justice the, and stuff. Okay. Post it in the roll twenty chat, because then our viewers can see what is in Spanish. I am a nice shark. By what? the way, hello stream. Hello stream. Hi stream. Hi uh, stream. That's what it says. Blessing for the living, a bouquet of flowers for the dead, with the sword of justice, a punishment of death for the wicked. So it gets the altar of the saints in the name of the Virgin Mary. This hammer strikes every injustice. Hammer! Oh, what's it from? Drop the hammer. What's up, Wasp? Hi! Okay, are we back? Glad you like the map, Wasp. Uh, Georgia, can you zoom in out a bit just to show the whole thing? Hi, Watchers! Thanks for joining us. 70%. I'm your, uh, Learn right. I'm your ducky that. player. I am the Trisha. What's up? I'm your friendly DM. Alright, let's... All Matthew you. and All you. Elise, tell me what's up. I'll tell you what's up. The sky, the roof, everything. Okay, I'm done. Well, no, you, you know what it means. I know. I'm sorry. Had to be a smart ass. Okay. Oh. Um. Yeah. So Elise had just gone through explaining that her parents would be on board with this. They just didn't know what else to do. Well, all I've left is talking to my father. <laughs> yeah, your father. It's going to be fun. Okay, um, I think that we should probably join everyone else. I don't want to. Yeah, they miss you as much as I do. Oh, I miss you guys. <laughs> and she leads them out of the room down to where everyone else is. Where is everyone else? In the main. Yeah, everyone's, everyone's in the main. main. Oh, okay. Main well, that's a... So they go there. Yep. So does she go in there? Yeah, everyone's in there. Go tackle hug of love now! <laughs> oh, yes. Right. Big tackle hug. Oh, he's just gonna kiss Ducky's head. Yay! <laughs> Did Lohengrin ever meet Elise? Yes. yes. Okay, that's right. In fact, he met her scarf. first. <laughs> oh, that's right, that's right. If you recall. That's right. The very, very fucking beginning of forever ago. Hey, Elise, long time no see. Hi, everybody! <laughs> Very happy to see you all. Hugs for everyone. Big tight hugs for everyone. Ducky's gonna look at Matthew significantly. <laughs> significantly. Matthew will nod, of, of with like an ambitious face of just. And and Ducky will nod with a <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What? How have you guys been? How? How was everything? I assume you took care of everything. Get quiet, realizing she probably shouldn't talk about it in, in the open. It's we, okay. We took there's care been of... a lot of ups and downs. Oh, well, has everyone made it out okay? Yeah. Well, <laughs> I don't think we should go to that town, though. I mean, it's not like it was a bad thing. It was just one of those. Bad things. Oh, which one, Jaden? Yeah. Oh, I thought we were, that's what we were talking yeah. about. Don't you guys have to go back? Yeah. yeah. I mean, there's an execution today. Oh, what? Oh, I'm gonna miss it. Yeah. Execution? What happened? Oh, oh my the rule goodness happened. gracious! Great balls of Pelorian fire. We could down a <laughs> Yeah. Oh, my. oh wow. <laughs> well, we actually just came here to uh, visit and, you know, catch up and uh, 
learn about what's going on, and then we gotta gotta get back. But we'll be back here because there's things that have to get done for you know stuff. Yeah. Elise is gonna look at Ducky like really Ducky. <laughs> <laughs> I am the most subtle. <laughs> Super subtle. Princess of subtlety. I'm Prince Subtlety. Well, at least I've I'll... been really tired. I've lost it. <laughs> oh. Well, so, did we learn about, you know, stuff yet? I'm gonna, or I'm going we... to whisper to Ducky. 3,000. Okay. That's what she said. <laughs> It's not too bad. <laughs> I think. Hold on. She starts counting how much she has. 3,000 gold for your dowry, huh? Wait, we were whispering, Wallengren. Would you just get with the program? So I, I figured you guys just came here. I mean, we came a couple hundred miles for this. Might as well say oh. it. Okay, yeah, 3,000. Yeah, 3,000. <laughs> well, well, we can... I mean, we have like four houses over in Calmonia. Or oh, Jaden, or maybe we can just sell one of those. I don't know. Yeah. Isn't John with them right now? No, John's no. with them. No. Oh, okay. I for a second, for some reason, I thought he was with them. No, oh, okay, John well, left you alone with Matthew, and then you guys went to us. Okay. How do you think John and his father will take the uh, buying out of the dowry thing? My father? Not well. John should be okay. Heartbroken, but you know, understanding. This is, this is something that. This is something I have to face. I really didn't want to see that man again, but. Family trouble? Family mishaps. Family yeah. mishaps. Familial mishaps. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Well, they invited us all to dinner, so. Yeah, we should head over there. You'll have to tell me how your vacation went. <laughs> Well, I was saying that because we could talk to your father at dinner. Yeah. That is true. You ready for this, Matthew? I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Okay. To burn your house to the ground? A <laughs> 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 sweet lord. Spill the blood of the non-innocent because your family's a bunch of assholes? Nanashi, you're passed out right now. And no. the wreck... And the record oh, slips off of the jukebox. John enters the room. <laughs> well then. Hey everyone, do you guys travel well? We're a bit tired, but travel's good. 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 Yeah, She's kind of nodding <laughs> awkwardly. <laughs> she kind of nods awkwardly. Likewise, like, yeah, stuff. What time is the dinner? Uh, still a couple hours. We weren't expecting big guests, so we're getting it all set up now. Uh, you're free to walk around the town. Um, I mean, the guards all know who you guys are, so... Or at least most of them do. Then if it's alright, we'll be right back. Oh. Yeah, have fun. Is your mom around? Uh, yeah, she's... I wanted to say and... hi. Yeah, I'll show you. Yeah, she's working. I'll show you. Okay. I'll be back. I'm just gonna say hi. You know. Or at least let's turn to everyone. No, and you haven't seen Daniel recently, have you? Where is he? Is he still high? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> John How says, is he, by the he, way? Daniel's not high anymore. He's he's just doing well. well he's good um. Goodness. He's putting his nose to the grindstone and working hard on being a guard. Oh. He wants to he wants to build up. He doesn't want to go the noble wa noble route. He's just. Where is he right now? Uh, he's out on the training grounds near the guardhouse, actually. If you want to go see him, he's... I'd like to I'm meet sure he has plenty of apologies for you. I'd like to meet him. It, the last part was... The last time I met him was kind of... Not really the best way to meet... Yeah, he told me... He told me some stories. He has glimpses of what happened during that whole encounter. He thought he was attacking me. And even he felt worse at that. Then he learned about you and it got worse. <laughs> How much does he know about that? the whole me thing? Evil um, angel. <laughs> he's our oldest brother, so um, he knows probably more than. Well, he, he he's closer to knowing 
I don't know. He he knows a lot. I'll just say that. All right. I'll go visit him. Yeah. It's uh. Yeah. I'll t- yeah, ducky this way. I'll show you, mom. <laughs> okay, and then I'll I'll go see Daniel later. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. We'll wait for you here, ducky. Oh, okay. It won't take long. I'm just gonna. Okay. Tell her I said <laughs> hi. You're not gonna say okay. Sure. <laughs> she just goes. Yeah, well, John. Whatever, man. His mom. Did Elise stay? Who's? Well, he's just still with everyone else. Okay. She's just working on some paperwork, so you can just. She's right in here, and he leads you inside of a room, and the mom's working at some stuff. Yeah. Hey, Mom, d- uh, Ducky, that little red-headed girl from a few months ago, Matthew's friend, decided to stop on by with his, her buddies, and they're all waiting in the Grand Hall. She's like, oh, oh, okay. I'm, I'm very busy. I'll, can I see you all at dinner? Oh, okay. I just wanted to say hi. So, hi. I'll no, you, you can stay here in the chair. It's fine. Yeah, just... Uh, I'm just working. It'd be nice to talk to someone. It's, uh, oh. How have you been? How's your travels? Oh, well, we've been traveling. And give me a second. I think my player needs to sneeze. <laughs> okay, it didn't happen. <laughs> All right. False alarm <laughs> oh, that sneeze. Was, I was, like, waiting for that. God damn. Okay. Ugh. All right. Yes, Ducky's here. <laughs> She's gonna sit there and talk for a bit. Right, yeah. Okay, cool. So uh, you, you tell her a little bit about the adventures? Yeah, like, uh, touching upon the travels and vacation time. Yeah. And where is my son Matthew? Uh, he said, John says he's with you guys, but he oh. didn't want to come up to see his mom? Oh, um, I think he's waiting for dinner, you know, because then everyone's gonna be there and... Uh, He's probably not too happy with me. And speaking of which, at husband. their dinner table, is there like oh. a sky roof? Because he said <laughs> everyone's gonna do that, and so he's just gonna fall through the roof and land on the table. Please, please Wait, don't. what's going on? I'm talking about how Nanashi's gonna crash <laughs> dinner by falling through the ceiling and landing on the table. Well, considering you don't know about dinner. I don't, you guys, but you know, I'm everybody having, has to have remember dinner. The, remember the mishaps of Sharon Cassidy's wedding where everyone just got in fucking trouble? <laughs> I'm having flashbacks. Where, like, two people got arrested at her wedding. <laughs> yes! <laughs> and one person was murdered before it. Yeah, oh well, he deserved it. For yeah. Oh, hey, wow, yeah, no. 14, 14 viewers. Cool. <laughs> anyway. oh, oh. Swag. Oh, okay, shit, we, we just lost like 10. <laughs> we lost 10. <laughs> because of you. I was one of them. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah, Ducky will say, yeah, um... Yeah, he was a little uncomfortable with the whole thing. And she's going to ask, uh, so is it for, um, John that this is all happening, or? Yeah, like, it's all for John. He, uh, oh. he really loves Elise, and he's been, I've never seen him light up around a girl. Really? Yeah, he's really, really happy for him, but I am sorry what happened the whole deal with Matthew and then we, we knew we'd have to confront this one day and it would be soon so we've been kind of expecting it um, my husband's pretty adamant um, he's very traditional you see uh, good Paylorian man yeah it's, I kind of got that last time I was here but I'm sure it'll work itself out somehow I hope so I, uh, just if you need any help, let me know. It's I'm really just looking after John, Elise, and Daniel. Whatever they decide is what I'll go with. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll see you at dinner. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Um, toodaloo. Toodaloo. <laughs> Weedle dee. Weedle dum. Buttaloo. Doodaloo. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. Right. Bitch, bibbity bobbity back the is... fuck out of my life. <laughs> what? Give Matthew his woman back. Alright, so what does the party do for the two hours that they have before dinner? Fifteen viewers come into my arms, my Ducky. lovelies. Yes. Let's go visit. <laughs> Let's go get more chocolates. <gasps> oh no, okay. Yeah, absolutely. I'd love to. I'm gonna turn to Elise. Are you allowed to go out or. Elise, you're totally allowed to go out. <laughs> Yes, I'm allowed to go with All you guys. Right. I, I really want to meet Wash. I haven't yet. 
All right, oh, and you meeting Daniel. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys want to go to wash first, or do you want to go to Daniel? Wash first. Wash first. Ah, yep. Okay. Go to wash. And so they did. Hey, there's my favorite customers. <laughs> Are your favorite customers? Oh yeah. <gasps> I have been getting requests all over the kingdom thanks to you guys. Oh. <gasps> Matthew, high five! High five! Yeah. <laughs> been, it's like it's been a secret thing. Nobles requesting, sending servants down from other cities just to get my stuff. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have to hire a couple people. You deserve it, Wash. Yeah, I'm thinking about delicious. closing down the antique shop and just opening a candy store. I think that's really? a fantastic idea. Yeah. As do I. Well, I might have to move to a better location, but I mean, Emerald is so close to the Topaz Force, and that's kind of my lifeblood for this business. Um, I'd actually want to buy more because my boyfriend. Uh, did, no, no, you're. Well, it depends. How much do you need? I could give you some. I've made plenty. Here, um, here's. Just take a bag. This oh. is like a 20 or something. Oh. Just oh, take it. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's a. Uh, Fucking sweet. <laughs> made me rich. You're, we're business partners now. Wow. Oh yeah. my goodness. She's going to eat one. <laughs> Ducky, you're his marketing team. Thank you so much. Thank oh you so much, Wash. For Wasp who asks who the hell opens a candy shop. They're located next to the Topaz Forest, which is known for its sap that when it's petrified, it turns into an additive to recipes that make things unnaturally sweet. Uh, given that, Wash, the character, opened up a candy shop and started chocolate coating small pieces of the petrified topaz sap. And now he's, thanks to the party's advertisement, he's gotten quite a following. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Literally. Hey. Literally. Mm -hmm. anyway. Oh, a little bit of cold. <laughs> but yeah. We got just 20 candies, yo. Mm -hmm. Well, great. So, uh, how long are you guys in town? Few days. Probably not. Uh, how long? A few days now. Um, well, if you want, you can stay here. I have to go get back to Jaden all for a bit. That's fine. For the stuff. <laughs> you know, subtle nods, yo. <laughs> yo. Subtle. Yo. If that's alright with and you. I don't see why it would be wrong with me at all. Just take your time, that. come around, and I can, uh, yeah. Do more advertising for me. You guys are doing great. Oh, of okay. Well, we're going to see some very important people soon, so I'll make sure to drop your name. Perfect. And do some you, candies. Do you need samples to give them? <gasps> yes. Let me, let me whip up some samples. And okay. he goes in the. He tells you to wait, and he goes uh, behind the counter and gets this nice, uh, very nice velvet bag. And actually, has a couple of them, like three. And he puts a few candies in each velvet bag. He's like, here you go. Just give these out to the important three people. Three bags. Got There's it. Five in each velvet bag. <laughs> Enough to sample a small party. Get them in the right hands. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. So that happens. Mm -hmm. Ducky will accept happily. Okay. Thank you, Wash. <laughs> no problem. You guys are uh, doing me a solid. So. <laughs> well, I'm glad business has been going well. Yeah. Paid off my house. <gasps> wow. <laughs> yeah. It was almost paid off. I've been paying it off for years, but it's nice to finally just tell my broker to shove it. <laughs> oh, well, oh. congratulations. Yeah. Wow. Got to make shove a living it. somehow. By the way, Elise will step forward and extend your hand or something. By the way, I'm Elise. It's very nice to meet you nice finally. Nice to meet you. I've heard rumors of a lovely elf. You must be the bride-to-be. <gasps> Ducky's just going uh. <laughs> to... She'll look down and... Maybe blush a little. Uh -huh. Yes, <laughs> that'd be me. Um, I've heard so much about you from these two, and she'll gesture to Ducky and Matthew. And the candy is phenomenal. <laughs> Trying to make it last. <laughs> phenomenal. Phenomenal. No? I think I'm going to use that for something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but I'll figure it out. And he gives you a smile. Oh, good. Wait. I can help. <laughs> nomina, nomina. Nomina, nomina, nomina. Like a jingle. <laughs> <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> 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 Suddenly Muppets. 
Yeah, all right. Uh, Lower green stuff's worried. Uh, sir, add your candy. It's freaking great. <laughs> I like it. He smiles. I'd like to buy a few. <laughs> they make a small exchange and it's like, thanks. <laughs> kind of starts back into the crowd. <laughs> Look, he's really excited right now. Well, do you guys and... got plans for the night? I'm going to go visit someone and then there's the dinner. Ah, mm -hmm. you already got dinner plans. Never mind then. I was going to say we should all hit the pub. Uh, we will. Well, maybe another time when we're in town again? You know where I'll be. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Wash. Yes, thank you. Pleasure's all mine. And uh, he gives a nod to Elise, lady. <laughs> sure. Oh, Enrique. Yes. Uh, as they're, um... I forgot to say, but earlier that day, Ducky would have sent a sending spell over to Archlord Telling him what? Storm, Stormflow about the little old lady mishap and the staff <laughs> thing. Do yeah. You have 20 characters? How do you say that in 20 characters? Old lady, staff, like, goodbye. Whoops, <laughs> accidentally gave an evil artifact in a rule? No. Wait, 20 characters or 20 words? 20, 20 words. words. 20 words. 25 words. 25 words. How in 25 20. words do you tell that? Okay. Um, we. <laughs> Shit. Wasp? Sort of like that. They just killed like 30 well, civilians. Well, okay. So she has she two killed 30 sending civilians. Spells, so she has 50 words. Can I just. I did not kill. Oh, be right <laughs> back. It was a cult. Right and back. they deserve to die. Oh, uh, cult. Yeah, no. No, I killed this person. <laughs> but no, uh, nope, for those weird. watching, this is a DD 3.5 custom campaign. We try to balance out, um, well, actually, not, it's not even balanced. We try to do about 75, 50% to 75% role play, 25, 50 to 25% combat. Um, because that's just the kind of DM I am. I'd rather, I prefer DMing with more role play. So there's a lot more world building. It gives combat an actual sense of depth outside of just the kick down the door style of DMing. Um, which personally, I feel that's kind of lazy. It's because kick down the door DMing can be done. I mean, by flipping cards over, that's that's not DMing. Um, but yeah, at the moment in the campaign, they've just killed a cult, and they're preparing for. Well, what is the end game? We've been playing since October, so they've gone through a world, a couple world, of, well, a world event, um, plenty of quests already. Uh, obligatory plug to our YouTube channel that has. Uh, the videos since April. You can find that link below the stream. Uh, the YouTube thing with the panda. Click right there. Mm -hmm. There's a playlist there for you if you want to listen to that and watch that, catch up. Um, but yeah, um, thanks for watching. Thank you for watching. Yeah. Thank you. Alright, uh, so is Trisha back yet? I think you guys are all going to head off to Daniel now. Danielle. I think she's still... Uh formulating yep if she's doing what I think she's doing it could take a little while <laughs> I don't know well uh hi stream <laughs> I'm sure. Elise I'm an elf although due to being like um really well new <laughs> new yeah. yes thank you and not knowing anything I basically made her a human so she's just my human elf and you're all gonna deal with it and love her anyway like I do <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hi. Demand that respect. Uh, yeah. Elves are naturally like a hundred years old at adulthood, so they kind of have a better sense of reality when it comes to like mental growth. Yeah. And Laura didn't know that, but that's okay because I, I mean we all make mistakes when we first start playing. Yeah, we've been playing for about ten months. It's it's been quite a journey, and it's been very fun. Quite the journey. Sound off your favorite parts. Nope stick of the dragon. Yeah. Level 25 of the scar. That was fun. Yeah. Yeah. I made them make level 20 character sheets and they got to use them in a battle with a bunch of devils and uh, some custom enemies. Um, bite the they pillow. Noped the, they noped the hell out of a dragon fight. Uh, bite the <laughs> pillow was really good. <laughs> that was when uh, the party was gotten to an incident, which you can find in one of our videos. I don't remember which one it is, but. Um, like three sessions Basically, ago. the bartender... Yeah, three sessions ago, I think, yeah. Our, the bartender 
thought they were all gay for it, so have fun with that. <laughs> then we made Ducky watch as well. Uh, we play at random times during the week. It's really hit or miss. But it's usually yeah. 9 o'clock-ish Pacific time. Yeah, usually 9 Pacific, but it's normally any day. Just go ahead and follow the stream if you want to want, uh, get updates oh. for it. But it's it's really erratic. I have a crazy work schedule. I almost work at, I work every weekend, and I work a lot of weekdays. Um, I should come think of it, everyone on the stream pretty much works or does something where they're busy. So getting together is difficult. But we make it work. I have to say my favorite thing was uh, with August and the uh, stick. <laughs> oh, that, that was yes. so awkward. Where I gave you basically the Wabba Jack and you shit it out. I shat it out. Ledge. Question, yeah, what's up? Also, welcome to the stream. NDG Heartbreaker. Well, Heartbreak. The stream's on a delay, so it might take a second. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Is there a way you can adjust that, Jojo? Uh, I think there is, but I have to like look it up. I'll look it up after the stream. Yeah, we'll figure it out. All right, it's we twenty seconds, so let's wait. Are we waiting for something, or uh, we're waiting sure. for Trisha to get back? Yeah, also, when are we oh. doing? Oh. Let me know when we want to do Terraria or Unturned again. Okay. Okay. We gotta we gotta get the Terraria done. Tower. Yeah. I think my Skype camera's still on. And then now she wake up yet? <laughs> yeah, we can say that now she wakes up. <laughs> no, it's only <laughs> one more in your campaign. I wish. I'm sorry, we don't. Unfortunately, um, we're all tapped out, uh, and I don't think I'm going to be doing another DMing another campaign for a while after this, because, like I said, we've been going for ten months. So you kind of wants to be the, the player again. Yeah, I'd like to be the player once again because it's DMing for ten months is quite the journey. Um. Do you ask because you you don't normally have uh, people to DM well to game with? I don't know. Wait, Zaxter, said, Zaxter said he was starting a campaign, so I think yeah, I think Zaxter said he was doing that. <laughs> Shout out to Zaxter; he's been with us since the well since we pretty much started streaming. Yeah. I'm sorry, heartbreak. <laughs> sorry, heartbreak. I didn't mean to break your heart. But yeah, you can if you're looking for a group. Um, I know Facebook. Has a, there's a lot of ta uh, counties that have their own Facebook D and D groups and stuff you can look for and try to find. Um, if you browse Reddit, I'm pretty sure you probably could find a subreddit that has like a looking for group type thing. But it's a really fun game if you're not into it yet. I have a question. A Throne of Night. I've never actually heard of that. It sounds fun. I have a question. What's up? Um, does it not she wake up yet? <laughs> yeah, not she's awake now. <laughs> It's been like a while, but he's Yay. awake and everything's fine. You're still like on the ground. You feel embarrassed, <laughs> but no one saw it. Trust me, no one saw it. And now she will feel how he feels. First, he sits up, and now he is confused. Then he looks around, <laughs> and now he is aware of what happened. And now he's embarrassed. Meetup.com, huh? The uh, stag saw it. The stag saw it. Oh yeah, it's, it, that's kind of cool. It's just a meetup site for random things. You could set up what kind of group you want. Oh, yeah, cool. huh. It's like one of those mangas that are really sweet, then turns to some pitch black ogre cutting off its head. What? <laughs> I don't understand the context. Because raisins. Right. Trisha, hey. welcome back. What about so, sorry, I had family things. No, it's all good. I still have family things. It'll. Sorry. No, totally okay. cool. It's all good. Everything okay? Sorry. Yeah. No, no, oh. nothing bad. Just uh, we're talking about my car. <laughs> oh. All right. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah. I was in an accident, folks, but I, I'm, I lived. I, can I get a picture, sweetie, of that? Oh, um, I want to see how well, bad it's it is. at the shop. Okay. My dad has the pictures. I just want to see how bad, but if okay. it's not bad at all. From one to ten, I'll ask my dad it? to text you. Yeah, text me. <laughs> or just, just, just never mind. We'll do it okay. Time. Don't worry about it. Uh, so, yeah. What did I miss? And now she waking up. Cool, I'm really embarrassed. Well, now she's gonna stand up and he's gonna look around, make sure that nobody saw him. <laughs> yeah, no one's. You're like, you got into the stag woods and climbed to a tree and just fell off. No, no, a squirrel saw everything. The stag sees everything. Yeah, what All does right. what does the Nashi do? Is this? The Nashi's gonna like trail the edge of town, and he's just kind of like gonna like skulk the 
like the manor. Just gonna like loom on the manor and watch like to see if there like seems to be anything going on in particular. Yeah, you go around the edge of town. You can't get closer to anywhere because it's a decently sized town. Um, you have an idea of where the manor is and everything, so I mean, you're just it's pretty boring. It's kind of like if you were to walk around, like, I guess a block, and just stare at houses the entire time. <laughs> I guess the best thing for me to do would be to, like, try and grab one guard's attention and drag him off to the forest, knock oh his ass out, and have people search for him. You're going to find a guard to knock him out, and then... No, I'm not going to. I'm talking about possible plans. <laughs> okay, let me know when you have an actual plan. Okay, I'll be one in this town. Ah, oh, Trisha left him. Okay. So he's gonna draw a little bit closer to town then, and he's just kind of like he's gonna try and stay hidden, but he's gonna be looking around. All right. Let me know when he actually does something. Well, of note. Well, let me know when somebody like sees him. Just roll a shit ton of fucking d20s. D20. Or like what a sneak. Yeah, people notice. Oh. Yeah. Like how much? Uh, let's see. Hold on. What is it? Yeah. My. I read that in an owl voice. What's the bonus that the cloak gives me? Human things. Plus five. Thing. What's five to what? <laughs> Oop. Silent voice. Hide. I think. Yeah. Tied. Okay. Hold yeah. on. Yeah. Nah, you could roll. I mean, he rolled a natural twenty, so it's going to be a pretty tough roll. That's what I'm just saying. Well, you know. <laughs> Whatever beats a skill, but yeah. not. <laughs> not that. Yeah, you've been spotted, and he, uh, someone was pointing you out. I'm gonna go ahead and like continue to move along, see if they follow me. They don't follow you. They just look and make my rocket saying that there's a guy skulking out there. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting a massage tomorrow. Yes. Nice. Okay, I'm back. Right. Yeah, my people. Mom left. I'm good now. People know of your. Massage. Your presence now. I okay. continue to skulk. You continue to skulk around the town. Got it. Uh, I am the skulkiest. <laughs> Party you makes it to Daniel. The skulker. <laughs> Party makes it to Daniel. Hi, Daniel. Ducky <laughs> uh, waves. Yeah. Hey, John, you made it all the way out here. And you brought uh, the friends from last time. Uh, it's Daniel, look again. Oh, this is Matthew? Yes. That's me. Uh, he kind of like puts his hands on his face. Um, I'm really sorry, guys, about that. It wasn't your fault. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you can't No, it. no, it was my fault. Yeah. But everything's fixed now, so that's okay. Yeah. That's what happens under the influence. Ducky yeah. just nods, yes. Yeah, I was just with a lot of drugs. Anything you were being taken advantage of. Let's not talk about that one. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. Let's. Well, I'm glad anyway, you're better. Anyway, uh, nice. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. Taking advantage of. Oh, did that bear guy like have his way with you? <laughs> how How goes the training? Pretty good. Pretty good. They're letting me use my chain spike, luckily. <laughs> and it's pretty fun. Although I don't think I'll ever need it in this town. It's uh, we don't have a lot of issues. <laughs> I hope it stays that way, but just keep yeah. it, just keep it close, just in case. I always keep mine close. All right. You have a really nice one, by the way. Thank I you. Like it. Where'd you get it? Pelor. Oh. Yeah. That's some good shit. <laughs> Where'd you get it, Pelor? Uh. <laughs> you know, just you know, the. It's a, did did a god actually give it to you? Well, like, it was passed down by followers, but. Oh well. It kept me safe while dealing with some stuff. And I chose to go with the douchebag bear, and you <laughs> chose to hang out with gods. I think we could have easily <laughs> traded places at some point in our lives, and it would have been great. At least for me. Aww. It's okay. I know you'll you'll be the best guard person in this town. Yeah. Just, just FYI, if if someone in a town walks with like this kind of a curved sword. Try your best not to get knocked out. Yeah, I heard about <laughs> Anashi. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry, we we set up stuff to to stop him if he 
he does do what he did last time. I do hope you stop him. Oh yeah, no, we will. That, He's... that man needs a wall. He's as good as a child. <sighs> if he gets the attacks. Oh, see, now it's gonna happen. Yeah, he <laughs> is not prepared. He is not prepared. And I'm excited, because... The wedding's coming up. Are you here for it? I see Elise is with you. He called me out, bro. <laughs> yeah. You can't just let that slide. <laughs> Fight me IRL, bro. Fight me IRL. Fight me IRL, bro. 1v1, faggot. <laughs> Oh, oh, Speaking of the, the wedding, how, how's dad? He's pretty gung-ho about the wedding. I figured. But, uh... Oh, he's nods. <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, at least knows. Uh, yeah. <laughs> like John says, it's up to her. So Let's hope father sees it that way, too. Oh, he won't. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we, we know this, guys. He's, he's like a traditional <laughs> Kalorian man. Here's, here's he believes women should be at the home. That's why mom's working. Instead of out with her friends. Well, that's not great. Should be told, I think she likes it. Really? It's, um, I mean, at first she didn't, um, years ago, but, like, she really loved hanging out with her friends. But now that she's been working for a while, she kind of feels empowered. Um, wow. Started reading, uh, reading into the Arch Lady, and I think she got inspired. Mm. Yeah. The Arch Lady, huh? Heard she's a piece of work. Well, um, my break's over. I need to get back to training and everything like that. I am. Uh, yeah. You guys have a good one, and um, will we see you later? I'll, yeah, I'll stop by the house for dinner. Good. Okay, great. Everyone's we'll gonna soon. be there. Sounds good to me. Oh, Lordy. All right. So, what does the party do? Is it almost it's been dinner maybe, time? Like, uh, probably been a little over another hour. So another hour. Yeah, you still have a yeah. less than an hour. Back to that sending spell. Can. Can we just assume she can do it in 50 words? Why? Is that what it says? Well, I have two sending spells. Yes. Okay. <laughs> there's a break, and then the second like, one comes but, in. Yeah, but you have to add in stop somewhere so it knows it breaks, because yeah. it takes 10 minutes to cast uh, send. She will. Yeah, so give it to me. Okay. Let me, let me, let me uh, figure this okay. out. So I had like this dumb idea where I could like call up the arch, can roll play the arch lord and have him like purchase me like a five foot spot of land directly outside of Emeraldia where I just sit there. <laughs> I would like to buy five feet by five feet. <laughs> outside of Emeraldia. Dude, then, just cut down a fucking tree. Take it. <laughs> nope, I'm just gonna sit directly outside the gate and they'll be like. Huh. You can't be here, and I'll be like, no, I very much can. Build a treehouse. If you encroach upon my zone, I will. <laughs> that will be treated as an act of war, and I will. <laughs> and I will spawn justly. I am an ambassador right. of Altamira. Enrique, what was the name of the staff thing again? Gruel the Lichbone Staff. Gruel. G R U U L. Yes. Anyway, um, what do you guys do for the rest of the hour before dinner? Um, skulk. Jump to the dinner scene. Yeah. Probably gonna send yeah. the spell thing. Right. Oh, oh and skulk. demand that Lohengrin bakes her a cake. That's <laughs> happening. <laughs> a cake? I forgot about that. Yes. <laughs> Ducky, you want me to make you a cake? Well, I know your birthday is coming up this season, but. Miss Heaven says that since you're my boyfriend, you have to bake me a cake. Heaven wants me to bake you a cake? I mean, if you really don't want to, fine. No, I, I'll Just bake you a cake. Just, <laughs> Just yeah, kidding. I don't know how to bake a cake. I'll figure it out, though. Well, you just get a cake and you make it for 20 minutes and boom, you have cake. If at least can hear that she's dying right now. <laughs> Lucky, that's not how cakes work. Over, I don't know. Over. I don't bake cakes. I just make them appear out of nowhere. 
the market. Yeah, you can do that. Longrin, if you want to know how to make a cake, I can help you bake a cake. <laughs> you just make it for 20 minutes and you have cake. Thank you. It's... Elise. Uh, well, how about we make a cake at your house? You don't tonight. have to make me a cake. Or, or, the other, or another night. You should because Miss Heather. That would be lovely. Yeah, it does. I will talk does. to the cooks about it. Yeah, I'm sure they could teach me how to make a cake. Do you want? Do you have a flavor of cake you want, Ducky? Uh, I never really thought about it. She looks I'll like a chocolate so, person to me. Yeah, <gasps> chocolate. Good. Chocolate. We'll get chocolate. All right, and that's over. Dinner time. <laughs> you guys all gather in the dining hall. Um, it seems to look like it was hastily prepared to fit the multitude of people for the day. Um, but still rather regal. Because it's the Lord's house. Um, everyone sits down and the, the Lord of the town and his wife come in. And John, Daniel, um, and uh, yeah, they are all there. You also notice that there is a guard sitting at the, uh, well, standing at um, one of the doorways near the entrance. <laughs> Just in case. And dinner is uh, served in front of you. Um, Matthew, your father, opens up. So, uh, tell us about your travels. Well, okay. There. I'm, it was very tiring, and a lot of stuff happened. But we're pretty much just going around now. Wherever we go. How's the town been? Pretty good. Um, we've got things in order since Daniel came back. No more bandits, and everything's been good. Uh, have you come for the wedding? Uh, to be honest, no. Then why are you here? The dowry. What about it? I'm here to pay it off. Yeah, no. No, it's... I mean, you're, you're not doing that. It's, Is everyone there? At that point, his wife kind of smacks him on the... Sh like, does that backhand, like, kind of slap Smacks him in the back of the head? No, on his thigh. Oh, okay. And like a hay. Is everyone there? Just clarify. Uh, yes, everyone's there. Okay. It's like, no, I'm serious. We've we've already put 2,000 gold into the wedding. It's all prepared. We have the land picked out. We have everything. We have flowers coming in from Rosarine. It is too late. I'm sorry, but I'm here to pay it off. <gasps> nope, it's not going to happen. It's At that point, John steps in. Father, no, this. I've talked to you about this before. You're not overriding me on this one. We're going to let Elise decide. If she wants to go with Matthew, then we figure out the dowry. And he pays it off, whatever. I'll cover the expenses for the wedding. At least uses me. We go through the wedding. Everything's happy. But I don't want to be married to someone who doesn't want to be with me. So we'll just decide what she says. And he turns to you. Honey, I'll turn to her. however long you need to decide this, you have it. Just let us know. What fuck is this? A bachelor? Good. <laughs> we She's holding home. the last rose. <laughs> We can postpone the wedding if you need more time. If you want to spend time with him for a while and see what it's like, spend time with me for a while and see what it's like, do that. Just let me know what you want to do. Um. And he turns back to the dad and dad's shaking. He's like, is this really what you want, John? John just sits there and nods. He's like, yes. Do you honestly think mom would... Would you want to be with mom if she just decided... I don't know, if she was forced? If... He kind of throws his hands in the air and does this. If she was forced, if, uh, I don't know, it didn't seem right. It seems wrong. Father. No, women should be at home. That's where they belong. They don't huh? believe out adventuring. They shouldn't be going out and risking their lives. That's what men are for. He's um, like, I'm a, I'm no. a good, paler, loving guy. And then he looks, and then Ducky looks at him and goes, bitch, please. Bitch, please. <laughs> <laughs> women are safe at home. They need to raise children. That's what they're good for. That's um, what they're made for. Oh. No, 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 you're very much wrong. I'm very much right, miss. You're, you're very, very much, much a misogynist. You're so pig. wrong. You are so wrong right now. 
<laughs> and then Ducky. Chris steps in and goes, Ah, oh, honey, you got it all wrong. <laughs> Look, Ducky, uh -uh. you have all of these men protecting you consistently. Excuse she me, they're mostly without me. I have a clank. <laughs> What's up? He looks over at the shield guardian. You have a clank, yes, to protect you. He's under my you. control. Well, he she may is? be under your control, but think about it. It'd be How safer you for you to be at home. Ooh. It'd be safer for everyone to be at home. If it wasn't for Ducky, sex. a lot of us would be in a lot more danger without her. If without Ducky, this whole world would be in danger without her. So I think Women that's don't just a... stay home, you know. They can choose to, but they can choose not to. Ducky's going uber feminist, guys. <laughs> Someone stop her. Ducky, you should just straight say, I hate to say this, but every female goddess probably <laughs> hates you. <laughs> anyway. Ducky. Hey, Lord keeps a safe distance when they talk ill of you. <laughs> Ducky, you're a cleric of Paylor. You know the old scriptures and that it's very much men should be doing the dirty work of stuff. Women should be at home. Come on, level with me. You're a cleric. You should owe. Ducky's giving him the dirtiest look <laughs> right. Like, like, Lord they have to. She pursue. is not the best. There you have it. There you have it, though. She went quiet. She knows that's what the scripture says. Excuse me. So you follow. seem to think that silence means yes. <laughs> oh you know what the scripture says. You know what the scripture says, and that is what we should do. At I least never paid in this household, in class, so it hardly we matters to what me. the scripture says. I never paid attention in class, so it doesn't even matter. Uh, sorry. Well, I left home. I'm sorry. And I was father. on my own for a year with my dog. But I will be paying off that dowry. Ducky's gonna sit back down because this is not about her. <laughs> at that point, like, John says, "Yeah, okay. If you want to pay off the dowry, we'll decide after Elise decides." I, I decide. Agree. Oh, I will you talk are... to you after dinner, both of you, and she'll look at. Well, actually, all three of you, and she'll look at Matthew, John, and she'll glare at Lord Keith. Oh. After dinner, that is all right with you three. I will I not talk to you separately, actually. Sorry. She, she goes up to Matthew and says, all right, If that is what you wish, um, make sure you don't need time at all. No. To, uh, no do you I've been here quite a long time. I've thought about this long enough. I'll sit right. down and nod. All right. And uh, <laughs> she steps up to <laughs> at this Matthew point. and says, I love you dearly. The mom speaks but up. The last rose does not go to you. <laughs> the mom takes her glass and like tings a fork against it. Now let's salvage this dinner and actually have something nice. Let's let's just all eat and talk about fun things. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Guard bust through the door. Everybody is dead. <laughs> yeah, is Danashi doing anything? No, he's not. Oh no, no, he's still skulking. <laughs> skulk. skulk, skulk. <laughs> he's skulking. See, there's like it, like he's just only drawing closer. Like as soon as it like gets to nightfall, that's when he like starts like making his way in. And I wish Ducky yeah. wasn't is, an evil good character because it she's got two hundred gallon like pounds of water to just dump on this guy. Okay, so it is nightfall, Nanashi. Nanashi just like sort of like sneaks his way in through the cracks and like kind of hides in the darks of the alley. <laughs> All right, does he have a location he's trying to get to? Um. Like, to, like, a roof to, like, lay low and just stare oh. at the town. In the night. I am the night! <laughs> Alright, so you go to a rooftop to, that's overlooking what? Just overlooking, like, like, or, like, you know, the Lord's house, and then, then it's just, like, kind of the gap, and it's just a whole bunch of stuff, so I'm on, like, a really, really dark rooftop, just kind of staring. Give me spot. Alright, well, first, I gotta get you a hide. I am the knight! <laughs> Alright, give me spot. And a, and a spot. Oh, that hurt. Bat bad. <laughs> bad, bad. You notice nothing. Bat bad. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna keep watching. How long do you stay up there? Uh, what, until wait. they leave. <laughs> what, what roof? He's looking, he's on a roof overlooking the, the house of the lord. What are you Stay doing? Fucking room? synchronizing? <laughs> Basically. But I am the knight. I, I'm gonna be staying up there, stare, uh, watching until I'm either caught or they leave the house. Fucking melodious all over again. Yeah. Um. 
We'll jump to the party real quick. Does anyone want to do anything at dinner before the uh, at all, or just I'm have gonna to mention, jump I'm gonna mention if they know about Larry's wash. Daggers? You're gonna do what, Matthew? I'm gonna mention if they know about wash. Uh, the wife answers. Ah, oh, Wash, yeah, he's the candy guy, right? We've heard a little bit of things. I haven't had a chance to go down to get any yet. Candy I will, man. I will, uh, hint, hint, hint. I will ask, if it's okay, I'd like to give you a sample, then. I'd love to. Thanks. Thank you, Matthew. This is really nice of you. I'll, I'll give her, uh, two. The ones okay. that I had. Okay. Doug she, uh, will let him this time, because he needs to, he needs to get in good right now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. She hands one to her husband, and she has it. Mmm! This is really good! I might have to make a trip down there sometime. You should! The, uh, the stern look of the father kind of sweetens for a second. <laughs> and then it goes back to being stern. Like, I fucking hate happiness. Oh, I wish I could have got that bad. And he smiles again. He's like, you know what? I can't be mad. This is actually pretty freaking good. This, mm -hmm. this is really good. It's this fantastic. is pretty good. I'll say that. Fantastic. I thought I didn't know what happiness was. <laughs> I've been married for 30 years, and I've never <laughs> smiled this much since. Oh, shit. <laughs> I want to go sit back down. I'm glad you like them. Ye old Jerry Springer? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, Jerry, Jerry. All right, so uh, do you guys want to jump to the conversation then in the dinner? After just or during? It's, it's after, so I'm oh, not seeing okay. you guys want to go ahead and say the dinner is over with and all the conversation to be had has been had. At least it's done. It's all right. everyone else. I'm going to take silence as everyone agrees. Yep. All right. I'm just um, okay. okay. Yes. So, Nanashi, you've been on the roof for about 30 <laughs> minutes and you start smelling uh, very sweet-scented sweet smoke. Uh -oh. It's so coming from past. behind you. Wash. Oh. Yeah. Do you uh, behind you? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's uh, those, yeah. those sitting up there with you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <it's> sweet! <laughs> I'm just like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> just wait and see if you're going to crash the party. No. No. I'm just, waiting for, I'm just waiting for Matthew to be a man. <laughs> Smoke? Oh. And he offers his pipe. Crap. This is such a it. cheeky motherfucker. He, he looks at me, he's like, what's in it? Just cinnamon tobacco. One of the things I like to have. Some NyQuil. Sounds yeah. good. Anyway, you know, if you are spotted in this town, I'm to arrest you. <laughs> uh, he, he just sort of like turns the thos with like crisscross and just goes, you know, it wouldn't be the first time that I've been arrested. Yeah, except this time you'll be in Riverwatch. And it will be permanent. Huh. Yeah, you you made quite a ruckus. They had to call me down just in case. <laughs> you did something wow. stupid again. Oh, wow. So Thank here's how that. this is going to play out, Anashi. You're going to finish that smoke. <laughs> you're going to get off this roof, and you're going to leave the, the town. You will wait for your friends. I will tell you them you are outside of town waiting for them. Wow. That was the enforcer. He just sort of like sits there and takes a draw from the tobacco and just goes, oh, I never figured that it would just be like that simple of me just waiting and watching. Yeah. Um. He just kind of looks down at the smoke and interrupts him. Oh, this is good shit. <laughs> <laughs> you, you could, I mean, I'm trying to make this easy on you. You've been, you've embarrassed my family quite a bit when you attacked Emeraldia like you did. Uh huh. You're wearing special signets from us. We've given you special privileges to room this kingdom and have some bit of name of valor, and you seem to like muddying that. Um, I appreciate what you did at this scar. You saved many lives. You've done a great service to the kingdom. But you also can't be rampaging through towns simply because you want a sword, was it? Um, You know, just the only reason I exist anymore. What is we're, that? Why do you exist? What do you want uh, to do? My only, my only reason for being born was to find a name and bring honor to my family, and then that was lost as soon as, you know, I bothered coming looking for it. Or, in fact, the moment that I, lo that I lost the blade, 
and almost died was when I basically lost my name. So everything became completely worthless at that point. Yeah. All right. So what, uh, after you rampaged the town, you got the blade back? What happened? Oh, no. I just... No, that got taken away from me again. <laughs> but this time by the, per by the person who had initially... Who had initially blessed it? <laughs> wah, wah, mm, wah. Alona. Yeah, I heard that story. Yeah, and you know, I heard a I heard another story as well, and I'm I'm not happy about it either. I don't follow her anymore. Nice. Mm. You were unaware then. You didn't know what was happening over there. I did not. I was just told the to fight, and that's what I did. Yeah, propaganda does that to kids. Well. It's that's all my family ever really needed. Didn't really need a reason to fight. It just had a sense of duty. That was it. <laughs> we were just the ones without names. That's just it. That's all we did. Would this have any um? Just out of the blue, with what you just said, this whole story, and now learning about Altamira, would that have anything to do with a large package that was sent to your house in Riverwatch? You can't take the pipe back to spoke. Uh, wait, what was in the large package? We, we didn't open it, your package. We just oh. left it in your house, it was addressed to you. I never opened such a thing. I never even knew that I had it. Yeah, it was pretty recent, but, um... Uh, like, how? It's like a small crate. It looks... It was heavy. Rattled a bit. Sounded like metal. How recent? Um... Uh, I've been back to River watching what almost a month. Yeah, maybe like within the last ten days. About. Yeah, I haven't been anywhere near there. I've been up in Jade and L breaking shit. Breaking shit. I haven't gotten that report yet. <laughs> oh, uh, well, I can just give you the short, the quick and dirty. Give me an in depth while we're up here. Oh, okay. So. Ooh, some bro time with those. Yeah, I just basically like break down like. Bronx how time. we stumbled into the, the um, cult and what's gone. Yeah, the cult and how like I on how we just annihilated <laughs> them Complete indiscriminately, and then we fetched the ledger and then we were having it deciphered. Okay, and you got it deciphered and everything. Uh, yep. And then whoever has it right now, I'm pretty sure Ducky does. Ducky has a copy. The other copies yeah. in Jade now. Yeah, so like Ducky has copy. copy. Yeah, and the main copies in Jade now. And then I think it's tomorrow. Or Dark is getting get a copy. But yeah. yeah, I was gonna say, and tomorrow is supposed to be some giant execution, and I'm That's supposed to be doing stuff over there. That was all that day. Oh, okay, well, there was an execution today. Hopefully everything went smooth and nobody blew up anything. Also, you're gonna be looking for a guy named Lord Woodhollow, because he was sort of like one of the main leaders of the cult. He probably got away, I don't know. Alright, Woodhollow, got it. Well, um... Pipe's almost out of weed. <laughs> so. It's cute. How are you going to make it off this roof? I want to see. <laughs> How high is this roof? Like third story. I'll just jump Climb off down the drain. I'll just jump off and tumble. <laughs> you serious? Right, yeah. Parkour. I'll you do jump. it. Give me a tumble check because you're still okay. taking damage from it. Insert the Nashi theme here. In insert my tumble is amazing. <laughs> hey, if you can parkour and drink My tumble Dragon. is amazing! Oh. oh shit! That actually is, yeah. On a successful Sweet. tumble check, you don't take. You take no damage on your first 10 feet, and you take uh, temporary damage on your on the next 10 feet. Nice. So you, you take 2d6 damage, 1d6 temporary. Which we're not even gonna count because you'll fucking heal it. It's fine. Heal it. Yeah. But it looks like it hurt you quite a lot doing that. I was just like, Ugh, okay, okay. Well, like, oh. I just look up. I'm like, I am down, and then I just kind of walk back off into the shadows of the forest. The forest. 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 Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna like leisurely stroll out of town. <laughs> and then as soon as he's out of like sight, he's gonna start limping. You're never gonna catch me. <laughs> I'm right. like, ah, oh, my fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> my hip. <laughs> Alright, after dinner now. Perfect. Uh, Nanachi's not gonna be stopped by just, like, being leisurely strolling to town. Okay. 
Elise, you said you wanted to meet with people. Who? Which one do you want to do first? Um, I think she will talk to John first. Okay. So you came up with uh, that was quick, actually. Yeah, I've kind of known for a while. But John, I'm just gonna say I. I will, you are a wonderful man, truly. But, but <laughs> hey, doesn't have to be a but. There doesn't have to be a but, at least. There's, there's a but. I am going to do my best to stay with Matthew. All right. And that's what will make you happy. Yes. You deserve someone that wants to stay here. That wants to help you take care of Emeraldia. I love this place, and I've grown really fond of you, and you are a true friend. But right now, at this point in my life, like I've fallen in love with Matthew, and he is the man I want to travel with, I want to have his experiences with. And <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. All right. Um. I guess next thing is figure out the dowry. Yes. He kind of clap like does that. Uh, you know, like the closed fist kind of knock. Mm hmm. Like that awkward kind of like. <laughs> so awkward clap. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> that sort of thing. Um. We yeah, the wedding will be off then. Uh, yeah. I mean, your family's still in debt, uh, so yes. let's. Uh, <laughs> you need to figure out how to. I'll let that. you figure that out. <laughs> if you guys wanna, you and your family can crash here for a while. And Thank you. Spend some time here until you guys get on your feet. Not, I mean, as long as my father will allow. I'll try to extend it as much as you guys need. But, She'll um, grab his hand and look at him. Yeah. Most sincere look possible. Thank you, John. Yeah. It's uh, if this is what you want, then this is what I will have to give you. And he kind of looks down. He looks really upset. Please. Oh, she feels awful. But something she's gotta do. So she will let go. Yeah. Stand. I'm gonna. I'm gonna need a moment, Elise. You. Uh, I'll just. I'll be, uh, he's kind of pointing to the side, like awkwardly. I'll just, I'll just go over there. Oh, all the time you need. He's gonna go cry in his little oh. man pillow. In the meantime, Elise is gonna <laughs> excuse herself, give John all the time he needs, and wow. try and find Matthew. Yeah, I'm imagining Matthew's pretty close. Okay. He doesn't like you. I don't like you either. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to put you through this. It, no, Matthew, it, it wasn't your fault. It really was. It wasn't really anyone's fault. If anything, it was your father's fault. I'm not gonna get into that. Yeah. <laughs> it's also misogynistic. What? Okay, guys. Thank you. But, Matthew, I want to stay with you and chill. Go over and hug him. <laughs> Roll for listen check. <laughs> <laughs> she let go. I'm so sorry to do this to you, but they took everything away from me. I have nothing left besides maybe that you know unicorn thing, you gave, the unicorn you gave me. But other than that, I have. And yes, I make sundials. But I have, this I have nothing. I don't even know how to start getting this dowry money. I'll find a way. We will find a way. <laughs> and your Life father. will find a way. Life will find a way. What do you think I can say to your father to have him change his mind? Let me worry about my father. <sighs> We will figure something out. I promise. Delicately. <laughs> <laughs> um, I just 
wanted to see you. Um, I'm, <laughs> I don't think I'll get anywhere, but I would like to speak to your father tonight. I'll go with you. Uh, if it's okay, I'd rather talk to him myself first. Then you can do it. Thank you. <laughs> and she'll give him a kiss. And she'll... Lisa's is busy. She'll head off to find more Keith. <laughs> yeah, you find her. You're an asshole. Goodbye. But Keith, I don't know if you talked to John in a few minutes. I was... Yep. <laughs> Broke my son's heart. But it's for my... to please my other son. I really couldn't find a way around that one. There was no good one. No. No. It wasn't. But there, now that you know, there is another issue at hand, and that is my family and that dowry price. Yeah, my wife gave me a talking to. We'll figure it out. Really? <laughs> yeah. Believe it. I don't have a choice, really. Um, John told me he won't marry you no matter how much I force it. Simple as that. It's decided you want to be with Matthew. Fuck yes! I mean... <laughs> I do. Alright. Thank you. Just, uh... I've never been a good father to Matthew since I've given our history. You know this. I've never been a good father. And I've cared mostly about John and Daniel. Um... And even though it's only been a minute of reflecting... So not much, but it's. I think if I was to look at this longer, I'd see I've been a pretty crappy father to him. Don't tell him I told you this. Uh, just make him happy and make up for what I couldn't do. Just keep, let's keep that between us, because I think if anyone can, it's going to be you. And you're welcome back anytime in this house. Thank you. But don't go getting killed. Well, you know, um, that's really not my plan. <laughs> I know it's not your plan, but <laughs> scripture says women belong in the household because it's safer, it's easier well, to listen, your Jack. pill cord, all that. <laughs> okay, okay, before... But if you do want to carry a weapon... Which I do. Don't miss been... and don't get hit. That is, that is the plan. Listen, I've been around the kingdom for probably four years now. Make doing my business incompetent. <laughs> but before we have an interesting discussion over this, I think I will take my leave. And thank you. Of course. Again. Right. And at least I'll leave before when you she throttles him. <laughs> when you would like to talk about uh, the payment for your parents and getting them out of debt, just come see me. I'll we'll figure out where the money needs to go. Okay. Thank you. Probably, if you don't mind, I'd like to talk to you about that tomorrow. Because this sort of quickly. Like, it's been a you. long night. Yes, we all need some rest. And um, yes, and I've just gotten word from Thos that your friend has left. The city. Fucking has left what? The city. Oh. Yes. Oh. He's, um, no, no, she wasn't. Yes, she'll face palm hard. Don't worry, he's in no trouble. I was told to let you guys know that he will be outside the city. Oh, oh, well, thank you. <laughs> and chill, curtsy, and leave. Likely. <laughs> Off to tell everyone that Nosh the Nosh is an idiot. <laughs> she loves him. He's an idiot. Well, you mentioned those. Uh, yes, I will mention that. Both told what he that told me. So, so now we all know that. <sighs> <laughs> yep. All right. What do you get? Where does the party want to take this from here? I never would have thought that those would have to uh, supervise the Nashi this way. Ducky's anxiously waiting to see if there's a price. You guys know um, the price. Well, you know the price. I just need well, to I mean, out. like, if if like everything's, what's happening. So yeah. Oh. Um. Elise will fill them in, and she'll cool. stay true to her word and keep out what, what Keith asked her to keep quiet. 
Mm-hmm. 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 Alright, Ducky's gonna go out inside and see if Thos is there. If he is, then she'll just say hi. Yep, Thos isn't there. He isn't. Damn. Okay, she'll go back in. Alright. It's time, right? Chimes in. Yeah. So can okay. we revisit Let's the see. fact that Nanashi leisurely strolled through town? <laughs> out of town. He strolled out of town. Simple as that. Someone's typing furiously. I got him. <laughs> Was Lauren going to say something? Yeah. Yep. So what do you guys want to do for the night? It's been... I mean... I go to an inn. You're welcome then. Stay here, as far as I know. If you guys want, you can stay here. Um, I might head back to Jade and I'll... Oh, wait, I can't leave you without you. That'd be weird. I like the Jandel as well. Yeah, I'll... Let's... It's Marcus, let's go to Jade and L together, because that's... With Ducky. That seems like good. a good... Good idea. Did you want to wait until morning, or would, did you want to go all the way right now? Um, it is nighttime. Well, let me think... I would lose sleep if we went, but then by the morning we'd already be there. But if we leave tomorrow, I won't be there till the afternoon. And Miss Heaven should be on her way, or she's probably already... I'm gonna ring her up! I forgot I have a ring gate! <laughs> yeah. Alright, you call Heaven up on the ring gate. Yeah. She's just gonna check on the status status. Elise you know, is that. gonna hang over Ducky's shoulder. Well, actually, stand over Ducky. She's a little... <laughs> she's taller. Ducky's gonna get blushy face because she's surrounded by 18 charisma women. <laughs> now, if only there was a honey meet here, hun- uh, Ducky might go by. <laughs> yeah, Matthew would have lost that battle. You Where's call honey heaven? meet when I need her? <laughs> hmm. Hey, Ducky. Oh, did I wake you up? No, just long day traveling. And you Are see you? that uh, Heaven's there with like a crate, like a, a cart with a bunch of stuff on it, with uh, Henry sitting on the cart. Hi, Henry. Henry waves. Yeah, I'm about mm, day out of Jaden now. Okay. So take us. We're, we're making good time. All right, I'll meet you there tomorrow. Yep. Actually, no, not day out of Jaden. No, sorry, day out of Ragnar. Oh, the, the, we're a day oh. out of Ragnar. Oh, oh, then okay. Right. <laughs> oh. Well, maybe if time permits. Well, we'll play it by ear, but if you need assistance, maybe, um... Well, right now I'm in Emeraldia, but I'm just a hop skip away from Jane and Elle, so I'll just... Well, I'll call you tomorrow, how about that? Sounds good to me. We're gonna... We're gonna get sleep and make a early start tomorrow. Ducky will hand him two candies, because she has them. Thanks, Ducky. I don't have any of those potions for you anymore. No, that's energy okay. energy stuff. That's okay, this is a gift. It's okay. a gift. So. Okay, well we're gonna set up camp and sleep. We got a clearing up front here. So it's John Wayne, what? we got a long story. <laughs> mm. We'll fill you in. Just uh, we'll fill you in, buddy. <laughs> I play Ducky, hi. Okay, it's John Wayne. All right. Quite a story. Oh my god, for a second I thought you meant you were going to sound like John Wayne. <laughs> no, 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 there's a, there's a, a person, there's on the stream uh, saying, yeah. asking what's the story, and uh, this is a ten month long story. Yeah, it's a ten month long story, and it's pretty long. Basically, we're saving the world. That's and we're, out, story. We're, we're in the middle of uh, paying off a dowry, or I guess not, because one of our NPCs, Miss Elise, played by the Laura. Hello. Yes. She uh, she got married off, but we snagged her back. And we're going back to Jadenel where shit went down. Where there was an evil cult and we killed it all. Yay. Nanashi yeah. killed it all. <laughs> Nanashi. Hey, hey. You guys all sorry. are part of the killing. Nanashi plus elephant. Also elephants. No, all yes. of you guys. <laughs> all of you have but the nightmares from frankly, it. Uh, only Sir Marcus didn't have the nightmares from only it. Only Sir Marcus doesn't have yeah, nightmares. Yeah, because he did his job. It's like, yeah, I killed all those little bastards. All right, so yeah. sleep time comes for everyone. Yeah. Whether that be in an inn or whatnot. I will go to an inn. Okay. Deduct the inn cost. Oh, uh, okay. Five silver for common Pass room. Uh, two gold? No, was it? Yeah, I think like two gold for a very good room. Uh, uh, um, it's a good campaign, by the way. Anyway, 
yeah, what is the chances of me able to uh, Sir Marcus getting to sleep at Elise's house again? Well, you uh -huh. can sleep at the uh, the Lord's house that you were offered. All right, I'll do that. I'll sleep at the Lord's house. Yeah, go for it, dude. All right. No, I know that we just like stole your son's wife, like wife to be, but you know you got a pretty nice house here. You mind if I stay? Yeah. <laughs> I had. Nanashi, do, do you make anything. camp outside? Of yes, house? dude. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Alright, just making sure. Go sleep in the tree. Uh, uh, you know what? I'm not even gonna bother to sleep. I'm just gonna sit <laughs> sit awake outside of town, just like sit crisscrossed. Right. All right. You fucking bring a substance. Yep. Just gonna All sit right. there and wait. Uh, Nanashi, your mind gets the best of you while you're waiting out there alone in your thoughts about all of the kids you killed. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Bunch of evil bastards. There we yeah. go. You, well, was, they were cultists, but they were still little girls. Um, just girls? Uh -huh. I thought they were all little children. They, no, not all of them. Just, some I mean, women. There was like eight little kids. Some shot lasers. And then some women. I only killed two. <laughs> there was an you elephant. Killed, still. Yes, their faces are implanted in your brain. Um, well, not, well, only one of them, because the other one got shoved into a wall. Let's let's remember this. <laughs> oh, my sweet lord. <laughs> uh, uh, Matthew, same for you. You have... You just keep picturing the faces of the people you, you killed in town. You know that they were indoctrinated, but they were still people that could have followed a better path. Um, so, Marcus, you're fine. <laughs> Ducky. <laughs> um, it's surprisingly breezy in your room, Ducky. Ducky? Oh. Yeah. Did she leave the window open? Is yeah, she the gonna door, get, the you're going to gank her, aren't you? The door <laughs> open, like, the window kind of, like, Blows open a few times. Oh shit! She's gonna get and it. you feel like there's a couple presences in your room. What the oh what? Fuck? You don't know what they are. Um, you obviously like you obviously search around, but you can't find anything. It just feels like someone's there's a there. presence there. And as as it stays, Ghost. it feels kind of calming, really. Oh, but well, they creep almost in here. a weird comforting way. Did oh. Daddy come and visit? Yeah. Hey, Lord. <laughs> And uh, but you feel it like in two different spots at all times. It's not like a singular presence. Mom and dad. Huh. So, all right, I'll let you have that, and you sleep. Um, Wait, she does. Your nightmares are less if you sleep. Yeah. Do you sleep? Is she so she's not scared. I mean, you're probably scared initially, but you're you're tired. Okay. Well, she'll sleep then. You flew the entire day. She, yeah, she's she so. Sleep. Um, yeah, and then that and the nightmares aren't as bad as they that they were before. Okay. But they're still there. But they're lessened. Anyway. Morning comes. What's the party do? I will see them off. Pray. So I'm staying. Praise. 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 Pray for my spells. But yeah, Ducky will pray. Okay, you guys pray for your spells. Ducky uh, prayed the night before too, right? Yeah, she always yes, does. Like always. Who is going to Jaden and who's staying in Emeraldia? I am Jaden Dell. Okay. Um, we're gonna find Anashi, see what he wants to do. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Anashi, do you want to go back to the town where you can actually do stuff? Or do well, let's oh. find Anashi, let's find Anashi. Yeah, you go can with. find Anashi outside of town. It's actually, not hard. I'll, I'll <laughs> He's go just kind of there. Find um, Anashi. When she finds him, she will hug him. <laughs> Anashi, you smell like weed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think she smells like weed. Pipe weed's like different. Cinnamon. Pipe weed. Pipe tobacco is actually really nice smelling. Yeah. Two blows. Anyway, wait, Jordan, is Nanashi staying or going? Staying where? Staying in Emerald, yeah, or going back we, to Jade Nell? Yeah, they ask you if you want to go back to Jade Nell or stay here. Oh, you'd rather go back to Jade Nell because <laughs> you'd rather just burn down in Emerald, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then you're like, so yeah, you're definitely coming with me. It's decided then, Ducky. Are you ready to do the the travel? It seemed pretty tiresome on you before. I got this. Um, when should I pick you up, Matthew? Whenever you guys are done. Okay, I'll just come back here. Sure. And at least when we get back, we'll make a cake. <laughs> and he looks over at Ducky and smiles. Ducky kind of yay! Oh, she'll give her. Never mind. It won't work. Okay. Yep. Go ahead. Go ahead. Carry and, on. And uh, before we leave. Huh? Uh, how are you going to get the dowry money, Matthew? We're going to talk to him. 
Um, as soon as you guys leave, I'm gonna head back and talk to Lord Keith about it. Then I'll figure huh? something out. The, he said he was. I told you last night. I said he said he was willing to uh, work something out with us. All right. So we'll see. But wait, before Lohengrin, I think Lohengrin's the only one that doesn't have one. At least he's gonna give Lohengrin a sundial. <laughs> so now he's aiming with the sundial yeah, group. Sundial Thanks. club. Thanks, Elise. He's like, yeah. <laughs> cool. I'm a cool. ranger. I don't need this, but thanks. <laughs> Elise, um, I thank you, but I can tell the position of the sun in time of day. I know you can. I can. Yeah, at least as a ranger, I can too. <laughs> <laughs> just a reminder. Well, if you don't know. want it, I'll just take it back. All right. No, no. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. I, I accept your gift. It's, <laughs> I'm sorry. She's joking. You're welcome. Okay, well, um, good luck with everything in Jade Nell. Hope Stay you safe. Are, all, are safe. Of course. Okay. Alright. Goodbye. And the party splits. We'll start with Elise and Matthew, and then we'll jump to the rest of the party. Thank you, Mr. It's John Wayne. <laughs> what? He enjoys our group's enthusiastic approach. It's refreshing. Nice. It's yes. yep. Thank you, sir. You're very Thank cool. Thank you. All of you in the stream are actually really cool for watching. Thank you. Yep. Thank you very also, much. You know, message us her. because I want to watch your stream if it doesn't, uh, <laughs> in, like, if it doesn't conflict with us. I want to watch yours. So shoot me a message or some shit. Some shit. Yep. You some can reach shit. her on her Twitter at Clerical Mishaps. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ducky's Twatter. All right. If you scroll down, we have Twitter. It's Ducky's yeah. Twatter. Totally. Message us there. Yeah. Right. Okay, so, so Matthew and Elise, what do you guys do? So go find Lord Keith. To Lord Keith. Find Lord Keith. To the Lord. Yep. You all oh, are you in to his office? Oh, I thought you two were gonna like kill him together. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. Jordan, Jordan, keep your keep your murder boner down, man. You are, you are Sir Lancelot from the Holy Grail. I swear. <sighs> I'm like, it's it's not a murder boner, it's like your own fam- you like, what would be technically your own family betrayed you not once, but twice! Oh, well, at least hates- at least just will never forgive him for this. And Nanashi's <laughs> too- or not Nanashi, Matthew's too passive-aggressive to fucking care. Yeah. Who he sounds, cares? Sounds like a you problem. I know! Oh. It, 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 like, it quivers Nanashi to think why he doesn't take revenge. <laughs> Nanashi can beat me up later. the people who dumped him in a fucking forest and then tried to steal his girlfriend. All I'm imagining now is Nanashi quivering. <laughs> I'm kind of sad Nanashi didn't go for the attack the town guards approach, because I was really looking kinda forward sad. to those shooting him in both Achilles' heels and then dragging him off to prison. Wow. <laughs> all new character. Be right back. Alright. Um, you make it to his office. He lets you in. He says, "Oh, let's sit down. I have the papers here." Um, he hands you guys each a stack. You can look through. These are the expenses your parents owe. Totals around three thousand gold. And it is uh, from various things, different brokers, stuff like that. They took out some loans. Uh, one was a loan shark, actually. So the, they got cheated a bit, but they needed the cash. We halted the payments, uh, well, I guess inflation that the guy wanted to keep doing and screwing your parents, but, uh, yeah, totaling out 3,000 from all the names on those papers. Hmm. And it's a good list of names from each one. They seemed small, like, first, like, little help for, like, bread here, something like that there, mm -hmm. extensions on rent, to not being able to pay, pay the, um, the rent, uh, stuff like that. Okay. What's the highest costing thing? Oh, uh, it's the house itself for um, how much they still owe on it after it was they were kicked out, um, which was like fifteen hundred. Should just tell them straight out. How about you just mark it off entirely, and then I'll forgive the fact that you left me in the forest as a child. <laughs> um, <laughs> should we do we pay this all at once, or can we pay off individual ones? We make payments. It's up to you how you guys want to do it. Uh, probably best to definitely direct deposits. Do it all. I don't know. I'd say do it all at once if you have it. If you don't, make what payments you can. Um, talk to the parties of uh, 
whoever you owe, and we'll you guys can work from there. Okay. That's everything I have. It's in your hands. Thank, Thank you. you. No problem. If uh, you need anything else, just come see me anytime. This is uh, both your guys' homes now. At least I'm on. Wait. He kind of forces a smile. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, thank you. Um, shoot. So, is there is there any personal deadlines for you as to when you would like these paid, or does it not matter to you anymore? Because these are ours it, now. No, Lisa, it matters to me. Just I'm no longer in the equation. So okay. This is on your. This is all on you guys now. So okay. I'm sorry, I can't help anymore. No. I, I appreciate all that you're doing right now. I was just wondering if you wanted, if there was a certain, I can talk, if there was a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> I need to rethink that statement. <laughs> mm. so I got tongue tied. John Hard talked to forward. me this morning. The the costs and everything that we uh, put down for the wedding, they are being, ha he's handling all of that. Oh, wow. Um, we like he's in his own is in his room working with all the paperwork now, contacting everyone he needs to contact for the cancellation. Okay. Yeah. Okay, uh, thank you. And she will look at Ma Matthew and gesture that they should take their leave. All right, Matthew will follow. Yeah. <laughs> I hope to see you two back here sometime. You will. And that we haven't scared you off entirely. <laughs> Not entirely, and she'll wink. He gives a, an actual smile when you wink. <laughs> it's John Wayne wants character descriptions when we're on a break or something like it. Yeah. Okay. We, we can do that for him. Mm. Oh, his actual name is John Wayne in the chat. Okay. It's John. Why do you think <laughs> yeah. I've been. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't fucking know. I didn't read it. It's uh, in like this obnoxiously loud teal room. color, and it's hard to see on no, my computer. No, no, that's just you. <laughs> yeah. It is a bright green for me. It is kind of hard to see. But... It's it's brown for me. Oh um, no, it's a like a really green. shiny teal. So well, anyway, on a white it's backdrop, John Wayne it's would pretty like hard. some character description. Hello, John Wayne. On a break or something. Yes. <clears throat> Whose volume? Whose volume? Ours? Wang Chu? Um, I am not uh, able to control your volume. <laughs> if it's mine, then I am sorry. Is oh. it mine? Is it mine? Beep, I mean, I don't know how I can help. Um, I, could, uh, I know I all of it is being monitored by me. All so. recorded and everything from JoJo's computer, yeah, so. So, well, that, uh, well he tells us oh. the name for that because of the lag. Uh, let's keep going. Oh, he wants to match names with voices, so let's just go ahead and... Yeah. I'm Matthew. Thing. That's Matthew. Okay. Stream voice chat. Okay, yeah. So, okay. do a quick sound off the characters. I'm Ducky. Ah. I play a cleric. Boom. Yeah. Alright, I'm back. Uh, he, oh. He's back, and he's apparently a paladin. <laughs> <laughs> he's a paladin. He's our he's our Sir Marcus. Yep. Sorry Nanashi, about introduce the volume. Yourself. Oh, I'm Nanashi, and I am the fighterest fighter. <laughs> All right, Elise. Um, well, I'm Elise. I'm an NPC. <laughs> She's like a temp PC, a TPC. A temp PC. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, introduce yourself real quick, Sir Marcus, so he can oh. people can match their voices and stuff. Okay, so I am Sir Marcus. I am from the Noble House of Greystone, which is basically the main provider of wool and sheep. Just, just a class. It's just, just a class. Just a class. Oh, sorry. Class. That's it's okay. It's okay. Arist it's okay. Aristocrat Paladin. Aristocrat Paladin. Got it. There you go. Oh, cool. Yeah, I am cross-classed with uh, Genki and Crazy. Even though the... Yeah. She's just a cleric. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a cleric. I'm sorry. Genki is the embodiment of war. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, and there's also Clank. He's a shield guardian. He doesn't talk. <laughs> He's All just, yeah, he? except for Elise, like, who's a elf. Ha, uh, she's a full elf, that's right. And She's then the character that I, ta I speak through a few times is Lohengrin. He is a ranger and dating Ducky in game. Yeah, that and happened. To the person who made the comment, Can I think it was Wasps, that this sounds like a soap opera. <laughs> when we do our roleplay sessions, 
Sometimes it is. This is you probably the most it. soap opera thing that we have so far. Yeah, it is. Um, yeah, it is very. Actually, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> this is the first. This is the only time it's like that, really. I promise. I, it really isn't normally like this. <laughs> yeah. Now that it's this whole thing is finished, um, it'll be easier for us to actually get into the groove of regular D and D. It but actually gets really serious. Like we killed children. <laughs> or, <laughs> our, mission, our mission Just, from the, the opera, I mean the um, the soap opera, um, cliche Dr. is Sexy coma. Coma. Dr. Sexy MD. Dr. Sexy MD. Yeah, we're missing it. Yeah, we're missing okay. that too. Okay. So anyway, sound off. Or doesn't good. wear sneakers. He wears if you have boots. any questions, just shoot us a question. Yeah, I check the stream chat from time to time. I'm on the stream chat. Uh, there might be like a delay though because you know internet, yeah. but you know. Yeah. All right. Oh. We shall continue. So what does Matthew and Elise do with this new information they found? Okay. It's going to be so, a lot, but we can do it. Yes, we can. I'm just going to smile at him. But, uh, so Elise would like to talk to her parents about all this. But first she would like to uh, talk to John one more time. All right. You go up to quick. John, who's currently working. Yeah, Joe. Sure. Yeah. Hi. Hey, Elise. And he stands up and kind of brushes the paperwork aside. How are you doing? I'm um, doing all right. I've gone through about half the names uh, of invitationals that were sent out, so that's good. Um, after that, we got flower arrangements from Rotary to cancel. Um, luckily, all the catering's done here in Emeraldia, so that would be easy to do. I just have to go down to the one of the bakery houses. Um, but yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, hopefully I'll have all this unwrapped up by the end of the week. Oh, wow, you're making good progress. Oh, I don't have, you know. Just, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I just wanted to check up on you and make sure you were doing okay. And I have a small something for you. She will give him a sundial. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Elise. I will wear it. Always. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, just make sure Matthew's happy. Okay? <laughs> I will. And I will definitely be sure to stop by every once in a while. When I can. Sure. And, weird question. We never really kiss. Um, for goodbye? Sake? She will give him this strange, confused, you're asking right now look, but... <laughs> <sighs> she'll sigh, she'll kind of laugh, shake her head, and kiss him on the cheek. <laughs> she just can't do it. Alright. Yeah, he pauses for like, okay, thanks. Um, anytime, just want to come say hi, just go ahead and do that. I'll be busy for the rest of the week, but after that, if you want to make plans that we can go out to dinner or something like that, just let me know. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Alright. Okay, bye. 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 <laughs> yeah. Alright, there you go. And then, uh, so to speed this up, she will go to her parents, she'll talk to them about all this. Got it. And since they also have nothing, She'll at least will put it on her shoulders to fix everything, especially since her father can't do much anyway. Got it. All right. Is she speaking with them alone or? No, I think you can be there too. And I'll help. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> Perfect. It's understood that you guys will help. Jump to the rest of the party and Jade and L. Sorry, guys, that took a long time. Oh, good. All right, we... So, like, Nanashi, like, before they had, they were going to head off to Jay Nil, was like, but you ten bucks, the entire place is on fire. <laughs> All right, ten bucks you guys get to... Lose. Or guys ten get gold. To Nell, and it's not on fire. Now, who do you meet up with first? Cynthia. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You find Cynthia in her house in the East District. She she opens the door. Oh, um, she's she's clearly not ready or dressed properly for house guests. I wasn't expecting you, Sir Marcus. How well, have you been? I am doing good. I just thought since I got back in town, I wanted to check up on how you were doing. I'm um, sorry for disturbing you. Would you like me to tidy up and we could have some some tea, or? Yeah. Some bread. 
if you don't mind, I, I don't need anything particularly, but if you want, yeah, we can. She, she rocks back and forth. Yeah, let's do that. Just one. I'll wait here. Yeah, a couple minutes. And she shuts the door. And you hear yeah. ruckus in the inside. Uh, is the party waiting with Sir Marcus for this? No. Nope. <laughs> All right, so. <laughs> he went off on his own. We're going to say that she cleans up. And you guys have a little date on the inside. And we'll move to them. Yeah, that, that's fine. It's, that's fine. Oh. That, that leaves me. Because I have never done this before, so like it's easier just to pretend it happened. Say, so, okay, it happens. Just let it happen, man. Just let it happen. So she just opens the door, and Sir Marcus is standing there just like. In freaking full plate, cheese is like clearly not ready. Just like. <laughs> hello? <laughs> What did you say, Rose? Why hello? <laughs> Why hello? <laughs> Fucking Mr. Bean, are you kidding? <laughs> Alright, no, um, no. rest of the party, you guys get to the Lord's house. Yes. Excuse me, that's quite rude. It yeah. is and you Sir are let in. Bean. You're let into the house. Um, the Lord immediately is like, Where were you guys? You missed all the fun. Well, it was kind of grim, actually. Was, I didn't expect there that much cleanup, but you missed it all. Did you bash your wife's head in with that thing I gave you? Yes. <laughs> yes. I look at her and go, and I'm like, I appreciate that. It was absolutely fantastic. She cheated on me countless times, and I got to bash her skull in. <coughs> um, oh. <laughs> at least <laughs> it's just coughs from the other side of the map. <laughs> I'm sorry. I haven't met you. I am. Uh, this is crazy. I'm Lord Sparnsworth. I am the Lord of Jade and L. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. Hello. Hello. And I know you. And his face immediately sours when he looks at Lohengrin. Oh. Huh? What? What happened? He did good, Ducky. Yeah, Lohengrin. Lohengrin speaks up. Look, Lord Farnsworth, I'm not here to make you look bad. I didn't intend that the first time. Um, just cleaning up the town where it needed to be. It is nuts. Uh, Lord's farm with immediately tries to go back to his sunny disposition. All right, clearly friends with them. Oh, friends yeah, with me. he's my boyfriend. You have to be oh, nice to him. Oh, perfect. Yes, I will be very nice. Just okay. Yeah, just you made my guards look really bad. Ducky what is did a you do? Really bad. Lauren well, turns like kind of leans over to Ducky. I kind of took out a nest of ghouls. That is oh yeah, you know, do. kind yeah. of just took out a wow. <laughs> It's fine. Wow. I love the arrow on the cheek. Yeah, because... Yeah. yeah. Reasons. Uh, Lord Schwalmer speaks up again. All right, so... um, The ledger's almost done for you, Ducky. Uh, we've done the executions. Um, Lord Woodhollow is done with. Um... Yeah, I think everything's wrapped up. I was hoping you'd be here for the executions, but after that, everything's good. Uh, we I got, had a lot of stuff to do elsewhere. I got to reading some of the journal, well, some of that ledger. A lot's oh. in there, actually. Yeah, a lot is in there. Um, if you read it, it's dark, Ducky, just so you know. I know, I kind of skimmed through it already. Okay, just thought you should know. I know. Uh, yeah, there was footnotes in there by your friend. She said she's on the way. Okay. I got a letter in the mor this morning. Pretty dark stuff. She even translated Abyssal. Very, very wonderful woman who can translate Abyssal. Oh, yeah, she's really smart. Yeah. It's, uh, I didn't even know what Abyssal was, actually, until her letter explained it. Wow. But yeah, that's apparently dark speech stuff. New rule. Evil guy. Um, would you guys like some lunch? Oh, um, sure. <laughs> I've, I've set aside today to enjoy myself. I have no work for myself. It is all pushed off. It is all put off because I am once again, after ten years, a single man. I have no stress on my back. My town is fixed, and it everything's good. Um, I picked a 
house la a couple days ago. Do you think I can go there and freshen up? Of course, yes. you can all spend time at the, your respected houses. Um, take your time. They haven't been cleaned up that much. Oh, so I can it clean might, it? It might need some cleaning. Okay. Yes. Uh, did you guys Wait. settle the issue with the dowry? We're working on it. We left Matthew there to work on it. And I'll contact him see when he wants to get picked up. So, or whenever we're done here, he said that, you know, stuff. That There's fast, a lot to do. That fast travel stuff, I gotta get my hands on some of that. That sounds fantastic. You made it to Emeraldian back in a day. Oh, it's a little tiring, but it's not so bad. I would love to be able to try that one day, because that sounds fantastic. I have not been to Riverwatch in years. Well, I would not impose, though. I'm not asking. I'm simply saying it must be really fun to travel that fast. We're probably going to go to Riverwatch soon if you want to just hit your ride. I think. I mean, I'd have to pray for an extra spell or two. No, it's okay. It's, uh, unfortunately, I am a uh, very busy man, except for today. But yes, any anything you want, just go ahead and ask. My house okay. is yours as well. Okay. Okay. Um, lunch it is? Right down the sure. hall? Sure. Right. He invites you all to lunch. Rich people. Uh, Did Nanasha want to say something? Yeah, Nanasha is going to decline. And he says he wants to check out something and then he'll join you guys later. Alright. Yeah, so then I'm just gonna go and check out that, uh, stump, uh, place that, uh, what's his face? Slippery Pete. Slippery John talked about? Yeah. 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 He's gonna go ahead and check out that place. Okay. We're gonna zoom through lunch since nothing really happens. It's just merely a formality. You go to the stump. What you can gather from it is it looks like it was whatever door that there was was bashed inwards. Um, clearly signs of a struggle and a battle inside. Okay. Not much valuables left. It looks like it was picked clean by someone. Uh-huh. Um, uh, yeah, it looks like things have been, like, tables toppled, stuff like that. Clearly, there was a tussle somewhere in here. Well, somebody got, it. well, somebody got him, at least, probably. Mm -hmm. yep, it's empty. All right. He's also going to go and check the graveyard just to be sure that there aren't any, like, wolves lingering around. Okay, it takes the entire day to, do, to look through the entire graveyard at, like, a running pace. It's huge. Even then, you wouldn't get the whole thing. Well, he's just doing, like, a skim. Enough to, like, be yeah, like, uh, yeah. You probably check the eastern side then, right? Yep. Alright, you do that, and it's nothing, really. It seems just like a regular graveyard. Uh, for those in the stream who don't know, the town, this party, this part of the party is in is Jadenel. That is uh, essentially a giant graveyard town. But well, out surrounding the entire town is like just vast graveyards. It is where everyone um, in the kingdom tend to send anyone who's anyone is uh, their dead goes there. Even poor people who have the funds send there's someone to be buried in Jadenel. So. This is also the site of where the party just wiped out a, player, uh, a cult of Nerul. Nerul is the god of death. So, very bad stuff. Alright. Um, by the end that of the day, the ledger is completed. Cool. Okay. Yeah. And it is handed to Ducky. Yes! I mean, oh, okay. And her copy? Yeah, her copy. That's what you're getting. You're getting Gotcha. You're not getting the official thing. Gotcha! Ledger. What does the party do from this point? Because this is now that point where we've wrapped up everything that you guys are currently doing as a mission and all you have left is to clear up the dowry in Emeraldia and then you're completely free to do whatever you want. <gasps> what? Okay. Yeah, uh, uh, I guess... Quick question. Do I get any other bonuses to my charisma check when I'm with my interaction with Cynthia or is it just the charisma? Wait, say that one more time. Basically, I just wanted to make it out like add something to the if there's since there's no role plays, make a charisma check to see how much yeah, it's going me, along. Give me a plus four, four since she's already fond of you. Okay. And you the reason, okay. 
Also, for Wasp, the reason why they send their dead there is it's... Uh, it goes back to the original lore of the world. Every city at one point was at war with each other. And under the Stormglade house, they... Uh, there was a massive treaty that turned every city into a city-state. Um, so these kind of warring tribes turned themselves into thriving cities. This happened about a over a hundred years ago. And Jadenel was always considered kind of a holy site, and the dead were always kind of buried there. And since every city at the end of the war had to come up with some sort of thing to make them their own independent city-state, Jadenel decided to really capitalize on the fact that this is a holy site to go and bury your dead. So it is considered sacred ground to many people, uh, pretty much everyone in the region, and it's also a sign of status if you can bury your your dead in Jadenel, especially in certain areas in the graveyard where it's like just nobles. My hill is better than your hill. Sorry. <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> um. Oh wait, I gotta. I I. You said it was a plus four total or a plus four on top of my charisma. Plus four on top of your charisma. Oh, okay, then I gotta remake that roll. Or it's a 15. No, I was gonna say it's a 15. <laughs> it's anything. a 15. Congratulations. Your, your, your choice, Wait. Enrique. It's a What's your roll? What's your charisma? It's plus two. Oh, okay, yeah. So we'll, we'll take the 15, because that's how uh, it works. Okay, I'll do that. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, some, some, some people want me to make the re-roll and just add the different plus or not. I don't know. Yeah. Now we can count. You do your fine. Yeah. The 15th, got it. Wait, Matthew gave the cape. No, oh, no, no we, we, were, we were testing it out. She, she wanted to see it teleported. Yeah. I'm, I'm just telling <laughs> her that I can sell the cape. Oh, okay, okay. I just wanted to know what happened with the cape. He still has it. It should yeah. be at least worth 1500 for now. No, it was it was worth the uh, 10,000. Was it it's worth 10,000? Yeah, 10,400. Actually, yeah. 400. Yeah, that'll pay for the dowry and then some. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. You are cape. you're currently wearing a cape that's worth ten thousand, an armor set that's worth eight thousand. Um, the custom blade that Heaven made you is worth. I mean, no, I can't sell that one. Two people worked on it. Too much. It's worth. The, cu it's, the, the custom blade that I made. Yeah. Let's get that's real. Your, he just did the get real. I did all the hard work. That's fucking at least twenty thousand. You're wearing a lot of fucking. I legendary can, gear. I can part with Damn, the Matthew. Yeah, and I'm like you were in designer for brands and shit. Yeah, I mean your chain spike's the cheapest, and that's like a like a two hundred gold thing. I mean, that's a t like two times the yearly wage of a commoner. Just the chain spike itself. Just the chain spike itself. And let's not get into your equipment. <laughs> okay, okay. Your go, your go like back. possessions. Go back. Go I mean, you back got gloves the... of dex yes. too. Brace of protection, protection one. Goggles of man seeing. Chocolate. The death talisman. You probably just need to sell one thing to cover the dowry pot. You still yeah. have that rune of holy fire. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I want to keep the rune of holy fire. Rain though. chain spike, thunderstones, <laughs> potions. <laughs> Fuck, dude. You're walking. You could just cash out and live your life comfy as shit. Swag. <laughs> All of my swag. I guess I got my swag back. <laughs> I used to be an adventurer like you. Then my right. family betrayed me. <laughs> Pretty much. Alright. So in Jade now. Yeah. So what does the party do? She's gonna upsell. Give some candy sell, to sell, the Lord. Sell. <laughs> okay, you upsell your candy to the Lord. Yeah. No, she's not gonna sell, but I mean, she's gonna promote Wash's yeah, thing. Yeah, you promote Wash's stuff. You give him one of the, the. She'll give him two. Two pouches? No, not two pouches. Two candies. Fuck that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she's keeping the pouches for the fucking Arch Lord, yo. Okay. Okay. Got it. <laughs> but two candies, because he gave her twenty candies on top of the fifteen candies in three pouches, so she has enough candies. Yeah. Um. Right. That's right, Wash. I got your back. Lord Farnworth is very grateful for it, and he's very okay. happy, and mentions Candy. that he would have to send a runner out there to get him more, if he... Yeah. I can imagine an Olympic runner just <laughs> running up in there. Like, <laughs> yeah. The mailman from Majora's Mask. I know, right? Bunny hood guy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
That's not how you get the bunny hood. Yeah, it is in the running Ocarina of Time. You gotta get that runner guy with the. Oh no, you oh. use the bunny hood. No, no, I'm an idiot. It's been years. The bunny hood you get from the dog thing. Yeah, <laughs> and then you use the bunny hood to catch up to the yeah. that guy. Yeah, I'm an idiot. That is how you. Zone. Or or you jump off that one ledge. Dear. Or right. the bunny hood. Or the bunny hood. Yeah. <laughs> I just jumped off the ledge. Twig. Bunny hood. All right. You know how Twig. adorable Link is in a bunny hood. It's adorable. It's my favorite fucking mask in Majora's Mask. Anyway, so yeah, uh, Ducky Queen. <laughs> it's not even a mask. It's a fucking uh, bunny ears. Anyway. Ducky would like to read the ledger. <laughs> you read the ledger? Um, I would like to, yes. Yeah, it takes you, like, well into the night to get okay. through the important parts. You seem to, you skim through just the list of names, and you read little, like I mentioned beforehand, there was those uh, small descriptions of, like, what their person's role was, stuff like that, affiliation with the cult. Um, then there's the Odile section, and then there's the Malachi section. Uh, you can get through one tonight. Uh, she got through both the other night, or the other day. You skimmed through the entire thing. You didn't get oh, any details. Oh, okay, well, Odile first. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you get through the Odile thing that night, and yeah. you now know everything that the cult did. Um, it reaffirms what you skimmed through before. Got it. It is... Uh, Odile was and her family were definitely Odile's family was definitely murdered. Odile was tricked into believing the rules the only way to save them. Uh, she was led astray from Paylor in a multitude of subtle ways. Uh, Ducky is listed uh, up until the point when Lohengrin leaves, and so Odile. Okay, so the night that. Uh, Odile forces Lohengrin to either choose her friends or those three civilians uh, in your backstory. That mm -hmm. is the night that uh, updates stopped on Ducky. Oh. Uh, and Ducky is listed as written no. as not a threat. <laughs> uh, That's hilarious. Not then, a threat. She's a fucking Genesis Blade wielder. Uh, there's <laughs> there's a lot of descriptions led on... Um, <laughs> just descriptions continuing on Odile. Um... Siegfried is listed as doubtful to ever leave the temple. Um, <laughs> wow. And Lohengrin <laughs> is listed as uh, traveling and could potentially become a problem. Huh. They just got it yeah. wrong on every count. <laughs> no, they were right on no, Lohengrin. Lohengrin, uh, Lohengrin. Lohengrin, Lohengrin is right. A, yeah, he's a problem. <laughs> and Siegfried didn't really leave the, the temple until the scar, so... They're sort of right Ducky on that. is not a threat. Fuck you. Ducky not a threat is completely wrong, but they were right on two out of three for the most part. There's a reason for Awesome Town, you yeah. guys. You look There's into Odile's stuff, you learn of her studies, um, all the preparation that they helped her with through this, uh, for the scar. Um, you learn a rough idea how to create the, the teleportation pad that she used that one time. But oh. upon reading the ingredients and all the setup that it's needed, oh shit! Uh, you're gonna have to drop at least a thousand gold for a one-time use teleportation for one End person. Game. Oh my god! End game. Yeah. To get the materials, you have to have uh, there's a list of fragrance, and then there's you have to have two locations that are bound, and it takes a full 24 hours of preparation of the spell in order just to make one platform. Oh my god. And it's the first person to step on the platform is sent to the other platform. And that's why it broke that first time. Yeah, and so uh, if anyone steps mm -hmm. on it on accident, they will be teleported and the platform will break. It's very, 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 um, what you call it? experimental, if what it sounds like. Wow. Meant to be used as a last minute escape when things go completely awry. Wow. Wow, that... Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's some good information. <laughs> yep. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Does, do you want to read into the, the regrants? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Right, you need a blood sacrifice on both. Oh, well then. Two independent blood sacrifices on each floor. Well. In order for it to work, though. How much blood are we talking? <laughs> wow, really? <laughs> it's the first thing. I've got a few <laughs> sheep. <laughs> what are we talking about? Paladin, no! I've got a few no, sheep no, this that player, I don't... this is player asking. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Depends so yeah, on the stream, blood. definitely check out that website. It's got all it's our towns and descriptions on it. Um, and videos. 
the Dales. Ducky gathers that it was a sheep used on both platforms. And it's, oh. a, blind, it's a blinding spell for the sheep. Oh. What? I don't yeah. need it. <laughs> if my friend James is watching or he's watching the stream, ha, baby sheep die. <laughs> Deal with it. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to hear from uh, hear from him later. I know that. Anyway. Uh, and that's what you get through that night from the ledger. Wow. Oh, wow. Just wow. Okay, yeah, wow. Okay, she's going to elucidate a little bit. <laughs> and be what? very ragey about the fact that they thought she wasn't a threat. <laughs> Two lies for one TV. Over. <laughs> Such well. What is TP? Teleport. Uh, teleport. Ah. <laughs> Such well. I love that. It's John Wayne. You're cool. Oh, Wasp, you're I love so our, cool. I love our chat. Hello, guys. You're awesome. You guys are so cool. Thank you, guys. Um. Okay. Zaxter's still there. Sweet. <laughs> Is Axter still there, right? Yeah, it should yeah. be. I love you from Ducky. Boom. Alright, so what does the rest of the party do while Ducky's reading this? Uh, I know that uh, Sir Marcus is spending the time with Cynthia. Cynthia. What's Anashi doing? No, no, she probably still looking, and then as soon as he feels comfortable enough, he's probably just going to head back towards town. Okay, you're pretty tired, by the way. Yep. <laughs> probably. Okay. He's probably just gonna go to his house and then sleep for two hours and wake up and just be like, okay, next day. Bring us lesson, it's badass. Bring us and Enrique. Yes. Um, before she actually, because that was at night, right? When she started reading? Yeah. Okay, before that, she was gonna go check on um, Nicholas? Oh, that's right, yeah. You check Ooh, on Nicholas. Broken Nicholas. Because um, he was nice. She wants to go see him. And then she'll just check on him. We can just glaze over it. Yeah, you How's check you on him. He's still really upset. Um, Have a candy? Yeah, but, uh, you, you learn that the, the captain's been talking to him a lot and that he understands now what it really takes to be a leader and if he wants to become the captain of the guard. Got it. He has to let go of his romantic notions of how the world really is. Ooh, and you know what? Ducky's gonna be in full agreement with that. She'll kind of yeah. confide that she has to do the same. Yeah. And uh, you learn that he he really hates the world for what happened, but he understands that this is what really happens. So Ducky's right there with him. Yeah. She'll give him a candy. Um. But he uh, after that he then lets, he does give you good news that. The captain, after seeing Nicholas like this, does think he can be a worthy successor now. <gasps> yeah. Before, oh, he candy. believed he wouldn't be, because Nicholas was here. kind of a heartless romantic when it came to it. Mm-hmm. Helpless romantic, I mean. Um, heartless. Yeah, heartless romantic's very different. <laughs> a hopeless romantic when it came to how he viewed the world. He was friends with everyone. He didn't have the Naive. power to be stern with anyone, but now he's starting to crack down. He's understanding what being a leader is about when it comes to the hard aspect of it. You can't be the nice guy sometimes. You have to be, gotcha. you have to be the bad guy sometimes. Fesho. <laughs> mm-hmm. Fesho. And you learn he's going to throw himself into work. Yeah. Until he works his way through it. Yeah. Oh. Yar. Yep. He also asks if you find any hot single ladies to send him, them his way. Well, because <laughs> he can use someone's company outside of the captain's. Well, there's this Jidno girl. There's this girl from. Oh, is she? Well, I know one from Ragdor. I want. I know one in Farklore. <laughs> Wait, is Honeybee single? I don't even know. Nope. She doesn't know. He says he knows the Ragnar one, and he's gonna let the. King- the Lord take his shot before he tries to anything with her. Uh-huh. Wait, wait! You guys take. T- I'm. I give up. No, I- no. He's. He lets you know that he means that the Lord 
was going to try to flirt with her and see where that takes, but he, Nicholas <laughs> believes that that's not going to go anywhere, and he thinks he has a better shot with Well, if a I meet any really <laughs> nice single ladies, I will send them your way. Gives you a thumbs up. Thank you, Ducky. Mm-hmm. All right, was... Now, we're going to hop back to Laura and Matthew, but what we're going to do is, like, the smart way. How much money do you guys have? And how are you going to pay it off what you have? Because I want to find out how you're going to do the dowry. Well, I was thinking of selling the cape. Okay. So you need to go to Stephanie for that. Yep. So. So, oh, yeah, Elise has absolutely nothing besides if she's lucky, she'll still have her horse. <laughs> All right. So, um, yeah, if like, together their money is whatever Matthew has. <laughs> Sadly. But I think the best option, if it's okay with... Matthews, if they head to Stephanie. Stephanie is? Okay. That's gonna take a while. Should we wait for like the rest of the party to get back to us? Okay. We okay, can't. So that's what you're gonna do? We have no way of contacting them first. I think we should wait so then, then if, if that's okay with you. We. Shoot, I never figured out how much time. Okay, DM, how much. Let's say we go around and talk to everyone. How much time do we have to pay this off? Um, from what you gather from most of them, they want it as soon as possible, but they recognize that most of them recognize that they never thought they'd see a return on it anyway until the Lord mentioned that he will be paying it off. Mm -hmm. So they're asking if... Um, they're, they seem kind of upset knowing that they, it's it's considered doubtful that it will be repaid. And that the Lord said that they will have at the wedding. So aim for the wedding. And if not, um, the end of things yeah, things will be things will play out how they would if the Lord never stepped in. Okay. Oh, so we have time. Yeah. Okay. No, I think we can wait. So, if that's okay with you. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine, we can wait. Okay. We will wait. <laughs> yeah. You would know that the parents, uh, the house that's locked up pretty much, that's where ev the parents' belongings are. Like, everything's kind of being held as collateral. Oh, I see. Yeah. Except for, like, some clothes for them. But, yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, party, do, what do you guys do? And Jaden L. Ducky did her shit. I will check up with the party to see, like, what is our next plan of action. So, is, so is your next Ducky plan? done reading, or...? Yeah, Ducky... Well, Ducky does his well into the night. Like, it's, Okay, so this is before them. she reads, or...? It depends when... What's going on? Do yeah, I'm wondering when he's approaching the party. Probably, like, at night, because... Okay, well, she's in she her room reading. She spent the day with Cynthia, so... She's in her room reading. All right. I'll just wait till morning. No, no, she's probably just drinking until they close the bar. <laughs> All right, morning comes around. Boom. Morning. Boom. Okay, pray, pray. Praise. Okay. You prepare your spells, prepare your spells, praise. Um, all right, so Marcus, you find Nanashi and Ducky. So, um... What's our next plan of action? Did you, did you get a word of any word back from the Lord? Which Lord are you talking about? We know every single one in the kingdom. <laughs> Just kidding. No, really, which one? <laughs> I, the Lord of Emeraldia, or the one here, or the Arch Lord? The one you sent the message about the imp. About the what? Yep. The okay. Oh yeah, yeah. Did she get a response, Enrique? Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, it was. Uh, please return your full report as soon as possible. Got it. By okay. the way, we still have to give our full report to the mailman. You don't say. Um, mm, we can just go straight to Riverwatch. It's okay. Uh, let me go ahead and contact. Miss Heaven, see if it's okay if we hit the road because we gotta get going, and oh my goodness. And then we gotta find out what's happening in Emeraldia, so I need to use the sending spell for that. And then we can hop on over to Riverwatch. I'm really tired. 
Have you slept well? Sort of. Maybe next this night you should sleep better. It's getting kind of breezy wherever I go. That doesn't sound good. Yeah. Well, do you still gonna... feel occasionally, Ducky, the present, the two presences near you? That's not okay. <laughs> she will confide in Lohengrin like, I feel present. I did it. And then ring up heaven. Hi. Okay. Um. Yeah. You heaven tells you that she's near. She's a, uh, like a day outside of Camonia. Okay. Um. Will you be needing us? I don't think so. Uh, just stop on by when I get to Jane now. Uh, say hello. Should take uh, at least three more days. Okay. Um, cause we're really busy. But if you give me a few days, I could always just hop across the you know the country at any time. It's just we're really tight on a uh, time right now, and we're needed at Riverwatch as soon as possible. Is it okay if I meet up with you later? Of course. I will set up shop in JNL for a bit, talk to the Lord, get that stuff sorted out, and okay. then I'll be up heading north. So after that, I doubt you'll ever see me again. No, that's not right. You have to keep the ring thing. I'll keep it. I, I mean, you'll never hurt in person, Ducky. Don't, don't leave JNL until I can see you in person. I promise. Oh, can you zoom out, show them the map? Oh, oh, oh wait, you mean the entire world map, Wasp? There could be. Yeah. yeah. We don't know. As players. Yeah. Anyway. The booty bag. See you in 30, John Wayne. Go um, 30, John Wayne. But yeah, just zoom out the map. See the whole map, please. Yeah. Oh, you're at work. Is that work? <laughs> Got it. Anyway. Um, so yeah, cool. All right. Um, Lorengren talks to Ducky and tries to make her feel better. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, and uh, let's do a little roleplay there. Um, oh, okay. okay. <laughs> I'm like, okay, that happens. <laughs> yeah. Sure. So, what kind of presence do you feel like? What do you mean, Ducky? Oh, it gets cold, and I feel like there's a couple things around me, but it's not Paylor. I don't S think. Sounds like a ghost. Two ghosts, Ooh. but they're like not. Like what? Like Reaver? No, Reaver had the power to turn corporeal. This, these ones don't seem to have the power, the strength to do that at all. If they've been following you, what kind of has their presence felt? Um, kinda have they cold just that night. cold? Uh huh. And yeah, it's, that's I don't normal. Like to feel them around. Okay. Have you been around two people who have died who can't let go of you? You know, like they have some reason to be attached to the earth. I don't know. Have I? You <laughs> went through a lot in in the graveyard, so maybe. But if they're not harmful, I doubt it's the cultists. Um, attached to me? I don't know. Well, have they helped you in any way? They're just there. I mean. I know they're not mean, but they're just there. And, uh, I'm gonna stick by you closer, okay? That's all right. I just okay. wanna... And he kind of gives you like a nice hug. Okay. And kind of holds you close. Yay! And we'll make sure that you're safe. Okay. Mind having the same room for a few nights? No. He kind of just like face red. Yeah. Let's do it. Perfect. Um, okay. Alright. But yeah, if they turn harmful, we'll know what to do. I can handle that. And if they don't, then maybe we have some little guardian angels for you. That'll be good. That'll actually be really cool. It's someone to watch over you when I am not able to. And he gives you a wink. She kind of just blushes and, like, <laughs> nods. Okay. Oh, damn, that's in the stream. Oh. <laughs> What'd you do? I accidentally opened a link in the chat. <laughs> In the street, so. Oh, I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for it. It's gonna be like 20 seconds. Yeah, I'm waiting for it. I wanna see it. I'm gonna see it. it. Is it's it gonna porn be a, or something? No, it's not. No, it's, it's not. It's what it's Laura not. posted. Oh, it's what Laura posted? I see it. I'm waiting. Casper. 
gonna... so much hype, not worth it. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not worth it. Anyway, the too spooky gif was better. Um, yeah. I'm gonna send a sending spell to Matthew. <laughs> Alright, so I think so the map. The plan, like, how's it going? Can we pick you up and go to Riverwatch? Boom. Would it be okay to stop by Stephanie? <laughs> Alright. That uh, has been said. What is the reply? Reply? To, uh, to sell stuff. To She's got it. Okay. Ducky will send another sending spell. Can it be after Riverwatch? Because it's important so we get to Riverwatch ASAP has to do with, you know, a lich bone staff. <laughs> I'll ask Elise. Okay. Oh, yeah, well, that's totally, well, she would say, so, yeah, it's totally fine as long as we get this done before. Fate of the world, girlfriend. Fate of the world, girlfriend. <laughs> as long as we get this, like, as long as we hit Jaden L and, or not Jaden L, Riverwatch, and, like, have time to come back before the end of autumn. Are you kidding me? We're safe. Like, yeah, there's plenty of time. It's the 26th day of autumn. Decky yeah, takes an afternoon to hop skip to the end of the country. I know, exactly. That's why Elise is like, did totally whatever. Oh, do you yeah. want to go with us, or do you want to stay Sweet. here? I would like to go with you. Okay. If that's it. Okay. And so they did. Alright, so <laughs> the party. Okay. Wanna... So, Ducky. Wind walks. <laughs> oh, Ducky. Alright, everyone's picked up, right? So much casting. <laughs> so much casting. All right. Is everyone Nanashi? Do you need some uh, casting Marcus. money? <laughs> so oh, Marcus, wait, right? You shit. go. How many people yeah, can going. she wind walk? Oh fuck. Oh wait, <laughs> hold it. Hold, hold the phone. Oh. Give me a second. Let me fucking. Cause, Cause she's taking clank too. Oh yeah, so you got clank, Lohengrin. Hold on, let me find out how many. Ducky. Fuck beans. Sir Marcus. Wind walk. Okay. Nashi. 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 One Nashi touch Elise. creature per three levels. Your level what? Thirteen and fourteen. Thirteen. She's level thirteen. So four people. Four people. <laughs> she has to make a back and back. So and we've been doing trip. it wrong. We've actually. been doing it wrong. We've been doing it wrong up till now. You gotta go drop them off at Riverwatch. Pick From now up. on, we will <laughs> fix that. All right. Um. You only have four people with you. Did they include herself? It's her plus four. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, her plus four? Yeah. Yeah, okay. that's Clank, Tanashi, Logan, yeah. and Summer, yeah. Yeah, so she's too shy of being able to, to pick them up. Um, I guess you could leave Clank, because Clank can totally catch up. <laughs> He doesn't tire, he doesn't sleep. He, he just, just runs all day long, he just runs. Wait, can't Clank go back <laughs> into his pendant? No. No. Nope. Can't. This is uh, custom. He okay. can't. Um, <laughs> technically, he could just sprint from Jadenel to Riverwatch. I think they have a hundred mile gap before they lose track of their their master, though. No, if they're on the same plane. Oh, if it's the same plane. <laughs> yeah. If she's on the same plane, he can fucking find her. Hunters will speak of a tale of a giant <laughs> running through the forest, knocking down so trees. He can probably meet them at Riverwatch. <laughs> Climb that mountain range over Riverwatch and just... Yeah. That's what you want to do? He can, right? He, he can do that, yeah. He can. Yeah. He doesn't tire, he just... All right, I gotta, I gotta think way. if something happens though, because I mean he's traveling. It's a Alone. shield guardian solo running through the kingdom with a vicious frost axe with a giant axe. So, I mean you'd recognize that's probably not a good idea because it's gonna send a really terrible message. We have we have time. Is it a terrible message? If you saw a giant stone golem, <laughs> like stone wood golem, running through a city with an axe. Yeah, but this and you is were a town stone guard. Golem. He runs cutely. If you were a guard <laughs> or townsfolk, wouldn't that cause a little bit of a stir? Maybe I'll, she can no, put a sign on his head saying, "Looking for my cleric." If no, if you want to do it, tell me now. We'll do it, and I'll figure out what happens. Just drop them. Just drop them off. Would Ducky recognize it's a bad idea? Yes. Basic, okay. Yes. Then she won't. Okay. I think it's a fucking great idea. But <laughs> I'll be like, it's, it's a, it's harmless. It's cute. 
<laughs> He, he could even carry people along the way if they needed a ride. I can imagine it's right, like well, George of the Jungle running with Nikes. Okay, well, I guess, garage. uh... Well... This sucks. Give the report in Riverwatch and just come get us? Yeah, Ducky might have to just, uh... Fucking Titan. Yeah, she <laughs> will I actually... I saw him at him running. Mm. She'll go find a cleric. Ask if anyone knows how to send messages to Matthew. Hey, hey! I just have an idea. Something what about the, her. what about that uh, angel lady that also is able to do the cloud walk? Can we get her to help? Well, I asked Jared? her to do so much. Ask no, 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 Lysandra. Oh, Lysandra. Ask yeah. Samuel Dawn to help. I have friends who need like... pickup. <laughs> I feel like she does so much already. Out of character, I think that's a fucking great idea, but someone tell <laughs> Ducky that. <laughs> they are busy. They are the Sentinels. Well, if you have questions about the map, type them out. <laughs> and you can't stab the shit out of the goal of every six seconds he gets his HP back. <laughs> he gets five HP around, yeah. Don't stab my golem. Yeah, I don't think you can even stab him. Stabby, rip, stab, stab, stab. Nah, you can hurt him still. You can uh, hurt him. Okay. You could repair him, though. Yeah. So you guys want to Big run hole! Watch? Harmless cute is dangerous in D&D. Something that looked like a bunny eye in another camp. I will... Yeah. Uh, mind if I go to the back Monty back? Python's your DM, Wasp? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Alright. Um, so, Ducky, so do you take him to Riverwatch and then do another wind walk over to Emeraldia? Um... She's deciding if she actually wants to pick up. Yeah, she might have to just meet everyone later because she only has two wind walks. There's nothing else. Can I go to the bathroom real quick? Yeah, go. Yeah. Oh, we'll take a break. We well, I'll yep. elucidate on this. Fucking yeah. Christ. So there's a lot of thought that has to be done. Yeah. So we're going to take a break. Do you guys have questions in the chat? Feel free to ask them. Oh, yeah, AMA. Yeah. yeah. Um, um, DMs do pull that shit card on people. Yeah, it's pretty crappy. Got to be scared of that harmless shit because the harmless shit's the worst. I had a DM who uh, pretty much put us in a, a trapped room that just let out swarms, like thousands of rats, and tore us apart. And uh, okay. I forgot. Ducky has a third sending spell. <laughs> All right. I forgot. So she'll just say that. Uh, I'll cross that out. Um, she'll probably just send a message to. Elise and Matthew saying she'll have to pick them up the next day. Okay. Because that's what happens. Okay, so you guys make it to Riverwatch. Wait, let's wait till JoJo. Got it. I'm trying to think if I have any snacks in my, at all in my room. Oddly hungry. Is everyone gone or is it we just waiting on JoJo? I'm here. Jordan? Waiting on JoJo? Jordan? Root beer. Jordan. Jordan. Root beer. If you fell asleep, then it would be. Root beer. And uh, that was yeah. Root beer. Uh, they have not been to the creator of Goro yet. Um, that was it's actually the creator of Goro, not Gore. Um. It, it was, uh, there's, there's two names I took from World of Warcraft, and that was Creator of Guru and Booty Bay. The Booty Bay. I remember it was is, a long uh, time ago someone sleep? was asking me about names, and I decided just to pull names from a chat. Uh, Ocelene's the City of Monsters. If you'd like to know about the map, actually, we have a website that has descriptions of all the maps. 
of all the cities and stuff like that. Is your uh, money still with us? Should be. Let me add that to our. To he might be asleep. And for our chat, that is a link to the kingdom info. All locations, all that. Uh, pretty fun stuff. A lot of time came into this. I linked it earlier. Oh, you did? Yeah. Late to the party? Yes, very late to the party. Yeah, uh, Jordan. 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 Alright, if Jordan's asleep, then what we'll do is we'll say you guys make it to Riverwatch and we'll end there so you guys can do the role play. Yeah. Jojo, uh, Ducky will pick him up the next day. Yeah, it's all good. Alright, um. Yeah, XP. Uh, for session 1100, like always, because we still have. Or did Matthew level up? <laughs> Not yet. Yeah, okay, 1100. Yeah. The way we do XP in this game for the chat who doesn't know, there's session XP based on 10% of the lowest party member. So, lowest party member is level uh, 11. 11. And we do a custom XP system where level 1 you need 1000 XP to level up, level 2 you need 2000, level 3 you need 3000, level 4 you need 4000, and so That's on. Stupid. Yeah, it makes the early game very easy to level and the late game very difficult to level. But it also lets me give 10% every session easily. Um, How long has it been since we formed a bond with someone? Bonds and dispositions have been What are long. bonds? <laughs> yeah. What are bonds? We bonded, we bonded too much. We can't do any more. <laughs> no, we, uh, we can always bond. Yeah. That uh, no one at this position either, so that's done with. It's just eleven hundred for everyone. Yep. Yep. Yay. Alright. Good, good session, guys. Thank you so much for the session. Alright. Um thank you, stream, for watching. Oh my thank god, you thank guys. you guys so much. Thank you. Yes. So it was great much. having you all around. Mm -hmm. uh, our schedule for this is kind of wonky, but wonky. it's always nine PM ish Pacific. Basically, I post on Tumblr every time, <laughs> if that helps. I post on the Twatter through Ducky, if that helps. There's the Book of Faces. I don't know. Add me. We don't have a Facebook Add page, do us. We? Are we Add able to send uh, Twitch alerts to followers? Yeah. Well, I think when I go on, when I live stream, I think it tells us that we're on Okay, but we're not allowed to send like messages. However, you found us before, find us again. Yeah, and if not, you can always look at our YouTube. The tubes. Find it there. Uh, yeah. If you can't catch up on the stream, they are all there. All of our salt. All of our. All of our salt. All of our last. There's a playlist. <laughs> They're also listed um, on this post. On this post. In the post. Post. This post. If you wish. That site will yeah. contain everything, including characters, dead people, the map, random, dead people. <laughs> random crap we come up with. Here, you know what? Table of contents, that bitch. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching <laughs> us, everyone. Yep, wow. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thank you guys have you. a great night. It was very fun. And it was quite fun. Thank you, DM. Thanks, guys. Thank no you. problem. Thank you for joining us. Bye, stream slash YouTube. Mm. Bye. Bye, guys. Night.